Hello, 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 hello. Welcome, one and all. We are now live. And oh my goodness, I hope you're all sat comfortably and ready for a wonderful Sunday of Skyrim together. Or if you're watching the VOD, um, any particular day of the week Skyrim. Now, before we actually begin, I did promise the kind people in the YouTube chat that before we actually began, if they got the live stream up to 500 likes i would i would show them something very special something very important arguably the most special thing i know um and something absolutely truly wonderful and no it wasn't an advert that plays when you immediately open up the stream i don't control that that's on youtube good news is absolutely no mid-roll ads this stream uh, we'll get into that in a bit um but i promised i would show them if we got up to 500 likes something very special and of course the live chat does what it does best and we got up to 500 likes so chat this one's this is this is the something special the super something special it's you that's right it's you you're special you're special to me you're super special thank you chat i believe in you thanks for coming and hanging out with me on this absolutely wonderful what is it? Um, Sunday? Yeah, 26th of November. It's almost Christmas time. And it's, speaking of Christmas time, uh, I'm going to absolutely butcher your name. I want to say uh, Todd Leish or Todd Leish, but it's got the it's got like the accent on the O, so I'm going to absolutely fail the pronunciation. Todd Leish, yeah? Uh, Vivoste, Vivost. Oh my goodness, that is an incredible name, though. Double accented on the U as well. Four. Um, this individual has donated me one hundred dollars straight off the bat. I mean, I haven't even begun my day uh, by saying by accepting this donation, you are legally required to withdraw said funds in their smallest possible physical denominations and provide your contract as part of payment. Trust me, they like it when we do this. Um, I mean, the roofers have now finished. They have they haven't taken down the scaffold, and once they take down the scaffold, I'll pay them. Um, I'll, I'll speak about the roofing incident. Uh, basically, last stream, you might have heard about it. I had holes in my roof. Very bad. You don't want holes in your roof. Uh, it is quite, quite dangerous indeed. Todd Leaf Super Shattered $100. Oh God, there it is. By accepting this oh, donation, you are legally required to withdraw said funds in their smallest possible physical denominations. Oh and provide to your contractor as part of payment. <laughs> Trust me, they oh like it God. when we do they, this. They, they don't like it though, they hate it. If I gave my contractor just pennies, I think they'd throw a brick through my window. Um, but yeah, they did a really good job. The only issue was they went up onto our roof and then whilst they were up fixing some leaks in the roof, they were then like, um, there's a bunch of holes in your roof. You could go up into our attic and you could see the sky through our roof which is not good so yeah we had to get more work done but they gave us a good rate for it so it's okay yes it ended up costing more money but it's fine it's okay my roof now works um <laughs> welcome everyone hope you've all had a really nice sunday how late am i we've literally just started now i will want to explain what we're doing why we're here and why this stream is important. So, as the title says, Can I Save Skyrim in 30 Days? This is the continuation of the Skyrim 100 Day Survival Challenge. In fact, this could be the final stream, ladies and gentlemen. So, we're going to require a lot of attention, a lot of help, because the way this streaming series has worked is if I die 100 times... Well, okay, no, I'll scratch that. Better explanation. I have 100 days to beat Skyrim. If I don't kill Alduin... By a hundred days, the world ends and Alduin wins. There's a caveat. I'm playing with a hundred. Well, I'm playing with one thousand mods that make the game incredibly more difficult and challenging. Fix a bunch of the old exploits, so I have to find new ones. Then we go on to a even more additionally large problem, which is that um, I then have to. Uh, Every time I die, I have to lose a day. Alduin comes forward one day. Now, I've died quite a lot of times. To be specific, the world now ends on day 59. Um, now, I currently have 32 days until we hit day 59, which is not good at all. It's highly dangerous, and something could go very wrong very easily. I have to go through about half of the main quest, which is pretty pretty dangerous indeed but yes welcome everyone if you're new in chat that's basically the summary we've got 30 days this is an impossibly hard challenge of skyrim 
And um, Ryan Bailey super shattered ten dollars. First live Steam. I love First your exploitative stream. gameplay and may oh, have used it against my friends. <gasps> Good. For some reason, I'm all out of those now. Not sure why. I also don't know why that works that way, Ryan Bailey. I'm just showing my friends a good fun time and some new gameplay features, and they never want to play with me again. How rude of them. Uh, but yes, our current quest is to go to the Skyhaven Temple. Oh no, Cowspire Cal Ruins. Yeah, we're going to the Skyhaven Temple. This is our next quest line. It's going to be going to be quite challenging. Um, but I believe in us. We are, of course, joined by Gladys, the Corgi. Uh, Inigo, the Khajiit, and Lydia, sworn to carry our burdens. Um, when it comes to actually our equipment, oh my god, there's a lot of soul gem fragments in there, don't mind if I do. Our equipment is a little bit raggedy. Um, we have some good stuff and some bad stuff. God, the world will end in 31 days. That's never nice to see. Uh, we have this really nice ebony bow. That's pretty good damage. We currently do about 93 damage per shot, which with this mod pack, in base Skyrim, incredible. With this mod pack, still not good Cryx enough. Super Shattered, $12.73. Oh, hey, Spiff. It's not much, but help has arrived from Germany. <gasps> help has arrived from Germany when Gondor calls for aid, but Germany answers. <laughs> They've sent us tiger tanks to repel the forces of Sauron. <laughs> oh dear. Now, before we go to Skyhaven Temple, I am going to head back on over to um, to Whiterun, because I think we need to do some disenchanting, probably some looting, and that kind of stuff. Resupply, because Skyhaven Temple is going to be really challenging. Um, I believe it. I believe we can do it. <laughs> We're going to do great. Chat, don't worry. It's okay. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm so screwed. We're so screwed, but we're good. Help from Germany. Look, if you're a Brit, you're going to take it. Also, geez, thank you for getting 1,000 likes on the live stream. That's really, really generous. There is one exploit, a YouTube exploit, I actually want to test out on this live stream, but I'll wait for a bit because ideally we've got a, a, a few thousand people here to pull it off. I mean... Realistically, uh, if, if you have additional friends who like Skyrim, now's a brilliant time to invite them to watch along and have some fun with us. Glad to see you. Super Shattered ten dollars. Just turn all food into tea. Just turn all food into tea. Why well, I can't? I I do need to eat stuff that isn't necessarily just tea. But I mean, I guess I don't have to. Oh God, there's a stupid wabberjack. Oh, that was so useless. I was so useless. I do want to keep the chef's hat and tunic, though. Um, yeah, that's all not bad. Let me try and sell some of this nonsense stuff. Thank you, Gladys. Is a good time at the oh, I'm glad Mr. G Dragonfly is having a good time at the moment. Um, oh, my God. Ch uh, Chief uh, Beerpoot Beer VL, thank you very much for your generous donation. Uh, if your roof can't be fixed, fix it with duct tape. I don't think duct taping my roof is a good idea at all. Oh, here's Nine Dagger. You want me to temper it? Oh, God. Wait, Hassan, which dagger did I give you? It best not have been an enchanted one. God, let me sell you some rubbish anyway. Um, what have I got in my inventory? This freezing axe I don't need. God, I've got a lot of cash on me. Um, these iron daggers of corrosion can definitely go. The sapping one. The mace, don't need that. Nullifying, don't need that. Iron war axe of frost. Good stuff. Um, and the rest of this I'm happy keeping. There we go. Good. Good gubbins. Green Joker, thank you for your moral support. Uh, for moral support, I will give you 50 members when you hit 50 days left. Green Joker, we're already past that. We've only got 20... <laughs> We've only got, like... 31 days left, you bastard! <laughs> oh dear. Zach Neal, thank you very much for your generous donation of 10 Canadian Doolaroos to say delete the bow. I am of course not ever going to delete my bow. This is one of the few things I have that will actually keep me alive and potentially let me win. Gift the Wabberjack to a companion? No, I don't want my companions to kill me. What a stupid idea. Oh yes, uh, Spiff. I've got I've got a brilliant idea. Why don't you Why don't you gift a, a thermonuclear device to to Lydia? Like she can just fire it into into you when you're trying to engage in a melee combat and and take you out with it. I mean, I'm sure there's absolutely nothing that could go go wrong with that. Actually, yes, a, a splendid idea. 
that's that's how you come off um, to me, chat, <laughs> with that level of advice. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was just unnecessarily rude, chat, from me. I'm, I I apologize for my abhorrent outburst. Um, all right, down to White Run we go, the Speedway. DJ DJ Oof says brood, brood a kettle, slippers are on, feet are up. Time to enjoy some super spiffing skyrimming. Honestly. It's it's I love I love doing these live streams with you guys. I, I love hanging out with you on my Sundays, playing some Skyrim, shooting some arrows, having a grand old time, and trying to do the main quest whilst getting murdered. Um Green Joke says, Don't try to fool me. I saw you had fifty di fifty nine days left in the mod thingy. No no, that that's the mod thingy says there you go, it says in the top left the world will end in thirty one days. The mod thingy um, it says that the world will end on day 59 and we continuously shift that down every time we get close to um, uh, to the world ending. Also, you don't have to gift 50 memberships. That's that's a stupendous amount of money. Like, that's just, it's actually ridiculous. You don't need to do that. Oh, oh my goodness. Um, Leet Bongmaster actually donated with an incredibly useful donation. I was meaning to, to do this, which was um, if I hold E, I can access Lydia's inventory. Leap Bong Master Super the, Shattered uh, $10. You go, hold master. Shift and press E to access Lydia's inventory and hold Shift and press H to access Horse inventory without mounting. It's Good incredibly luck, useful. Thank you so much, Leap Bong Master. <laughs> Nick Fabri, thank you for gifting five memberships, you generously kind sausage. Right, um, let us uh, make our way into White Run. What time is it? It's getting a bit late. Yeah, it's 6 p.m. A little bit late in the evening. That's not too bad. We can still manage it. Was there a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding from Whiterun to old Rorikstead. We still haven't been to Rorikstead, and I'm, I'd be pretty happy with us avoiding um, Morphal and Rorikstead for the entire entire duration of the game. I just don't want to go there. They're just useless backwaters. Streamer brain turns you senile. Look, playing Skyrim every day, well not every day, playing Skyrim for like six hours every week for the last few months will eventually warp your perspective of reality. I mean, quite regularly I go outside and I'm surprised when I don't see dragons trying to harass me with aerial attacks. It's, uh, it's wonderful. Snagglepuss says, PowerPoint presentation on the defense economics of Skyrim in this voice when? <laughs> Honestly, I think we do the actually spiff the uh, the military industrial complex of White Run is a it's a really interesting thing. You see, the actual the large weapons uh, needed for the Imperial Army and the White Run garrison are seemingly supplied by only two smithies. Um, we've got the uh, the very important um, uh, war maidens, uh, where largely almost all of the smithing is done by just some random some random woman and then you've got the skyforge however you actually need to spend a lot of money to get access to the skyforge and they they don't really like anyone who isn't a nord and as a khajiit spiff you'll see people actually just hate you because they think you're a dirty dirty cat person which is actually true yep that's uh, what i have to live with um that's how it is <laughs> <laughs> Lampo, thank you very much for donating to say we believe in you, Spiff. You can beat Skyrim in the allotted time. Glad you got your roof fixed. I am as well. It's nice to know that there's not all of the heat that I use to heat my house just flying out of the ceiling. Um, it helps. <laughs> it helps me sleep at night. <laughs> oh, dear. Oi, oi, Adriani Avencini, a super random woman. $20. She's a champ, to be fair. No she is. She's, she's very nice. I've been loving the streams. Missions. Jeffrey Robertson, thank you very Aro much. Super Shattered, eleven dollars and ninety-three cents. Thanks for the things you do, and I always enjoy watching Aww. you. I know it's not much, but I want to support even a little bit. What do you Greetings mean it's not Poland. much? Aro, that's an incredibly generous donation. Look, I'm a, I'm a I'm a streamy man. I get to play video games for a living, and most of the donations just go on tea. Uh, well, I suppose at the moment it is literally just fixing my roof. Um, yeah, I, 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 look, it didn't cost me the, the fee of having to fix the entire roof. If we had to fix the entire roof, it would have been like maybe 16 grand, um, which would have been really horrible. But luckily, no, we got we got lucky. No no need to do the entire roof. Right, um, Gladys, where are you? I need, the, I need the enchanted stuff on you. 
please give it to me because I think some of this can be disenchanted. Uh, damnation, I want to Players take. Players in the Revolution, super shattered, well. twelve dollars and seventeen cents. Hi, Spiff. This is the first time I've caught you. Can't stay though, as I haven't finished your previous <laughs> oh, Skyrim. It's Here's okay, a fiver for your roof. And oh. I hope to be a channel member one day. Smiley face. What do you mean? Here's a fiver for your for my roof. That's two fivers. I know how to do mathematics, but thank you very much. Thank you very much, Plasma Revolution. That was very generous of you. Right, I'm going to disenchant this Helmet of Magicka. This can go. Do 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 do. Uh, the Minor Assassin. This can also go. That's useful. Uh, minor Skirmisher. I mean, this is basically a useless ring, so we either sell it or disenchant it, and I think the experience is worth it. Major of Ring of the Sky, uh, Squire is really, really good, and if we could get good enchanting, that would be very jazzy. Longbow of Damnation. Very nice. Corrosion. Actually, I think this is... I, I kind of want to get see if I can get corrosion on our bow, because that would make fighting bosses really, really, really good. Really, really powerful. Um, splendid stuff. Let's actually see if we can do that. Um, oh, here was something I wanted to see if we could enchant. If, I want to see if we could enchant gloves. Yeah, so I could fortify gloves with light armor. Could I fortify, say, this gold amethyst necklace with sneak attacks? Yes, I can. Oh, that would be really useful. Yeah, we could do some really good stuff with that. Um, what about these earrings? They all, they can also fortify sneak attacks. Good stuff. And Inigo's bow? Okay, well, we can't do fortify sneak attacks, but for Inigo's bow, are we able to... Uh, no, we're not able to do corrosion. Oh, how annoying. How annoying. Hello, you Tory. I'm not a Tory. I, Spiff is a politically neutral character. I'm a person who wander, waffles around, claims to conquer the entire world, and drinks a lot of tea. That's about as politically neutral as you can get. <laughs> rampant, I'll have you know, rampant imperialism is a centralist, <laughs> centralist point of view. <laughs> yeah, it's, it is a shame that we can't um, fortify corrosion. Where even is it on that list? What is it? Is it it's not this? Predator's Grace. You make less noise while moving. Resist disease. Potion duration. Wait, hang on a second. Would potion duration affect poison duration? I don't think it would, but that would be really, really impressive if that was the case. Um, articulation. Soul trap. Yeah, annoying. I can't find a... Uh, yeah, a way to destroy armor. That's fine. That's fine. I mean, I might be able to stick it on this dagger, for example. Okay, no, I can't even do that. Shame. A shame indeed. What is happening in this chat? I don't know what's happening in this chat. Let me give it a read. Um, Spiff, next up, try 100 days with over 1,000 mods on Extreme Survival in Fallout 4. I mean, I know Fallout 4 has the Frost. Um, it's got, like, the Frost series of mods, which are very fun. Very, very powerful indeed. Yes, I don't know if I'll um, get around to that. Okay, now one thing I want to check is, can I wear gloves underneath my gauntlets? Because my gauntlets currently give me um, archery bonuses, which is very good. But can I pop gloves underneath them? No, I can't. Right, gloves, I'm afraid you're useless. Uh, can I wear the chef's hat? No. Okay, I was hoping I could wear some of these clothes in addition to my other equipment. But evidently I can't, so that's... Um, that's a shame. We'll just have to forget the dream of being chef, man. Um, Gladys, I need you to carry something. Please take the chef outfit back. It was a, it was a bold choice that did not pay off. <laughs> I can't wear the chef hat. Um, I can also give you this travel cloak because I'm not going to use it. There we go. Fantastic, Gladys. Oh, Green Joke says, all right, fine. If you make a hit with the next 50 arrows you shoot from your bow, I'll get... 50 members. What? I need to hit every shot with the next 50 arrows. Oh my god, Green Joker, that's an insane. I mean, I'm going to I'm going to do it. Don't get me wrong, I'm going to I'm going to do it. Darwin's bow. Whose bow is this? That seems like a good bow. Probably some kind of quest item I've completely forgotten about. Um <laughs> but still, that's good to know. Uh, Farangar, do you want to buy some little gems from me? Because I've got some... Yeah. Oh no, you just want my soul gems. Well, you can't have them. I need them. You know, if you've got the Alright, let me uh, let me use this. Um, 
I'm going to see if I can, using my earring, fortify sneak attacks. 12% better damage with sneak attacks if I use a greater soul gem. This just seems like an incredible idea. Like, why would I never do that? That would just is great. And then I could probably do the same for the right earring. Oh, wait. Enchantment, fortify sneak attacks. There we go. Yeah, it's not quite as good, but that's still a really good enchantment in my opinion. It's Darwin's. Okay, we well, can't do that. Damage armor goes on bows. Okay, well, let me give that a try. Let me give that a try. Do, 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 do. Igni goes ebony bow. There it is, damage armor. I'm a melon. Oh, it's because it doesn't display here. That's why. Yeah, reduce enemy's armor rating by 50 for 30 seconds. Okay, if I were to not use Inigo's Ebony Bow and instead just select Damage Armor with... Okay, this would currently be 73 for 30 seconds. I, I want to get a big Soul Gem because I want to make that as high as possible. And realistically... Um, thank you very much, though, uh, for donating to let that know. Also, people are spamming you to put Damage Armor on the bow. Yes, I've, I've realized... Look, I finally read the chat, guys. As a streamer, it's my right to not read the chat too often. Also, goodness, we're almost at 1,500 likes on the stream. Thank you, kind sausages. Um, right, enchantments on jewellery are better. Enchantments on armor, robes, and clothing are stronger. Elemental enchantments are stronger. That's useless. Health and magic killer enchantments are stronger. Okay, so none of these are boosting my... None of these are boosting my actual weapon enchantments being stronger. So I have to get up to... Level 46 enchanting, sorry, 50 enchanting before I can really give that a go. So let's just see if I can do some enchantments on these uh, useless things. Um, white Fain armor. Isn't this the light armor I'm wearing? Yeah, I could put Fortify light armor on it. It's okay. It's not the best. Actually, screw it. I've got loads of money. I can just buy soul gems. Let me just buy some soul gems. I've got your back. Uh, sorry, Spiff, I meant to say here's a tenner. Thank you for the update, Plasma Revolution. Thanks for the two two pounder roonies, as I'm going to call them. I really think, actually, we should move to using um, uh, a... We should use to using a different decimal system for the donation. So, um, for example, Get Spooky just donated $50. This is now going to be referred to as Half Hundo. Get Spooky's Half Hundo donation. <laughs> Thank you very much. That's stupidly One sec, zero generous. LD video super shattered ten dollars. The enchant for the bow is name damage armor, not corrosion. You also yes. took your helmet off. I am aware I took my helmet off. I will m remember to put it on. Um, really, I should be putting on the helmet that gives me um, better better prices. But I'm a, I'm a melon. Thank you very much, though, for the donation. One one C E C O L old videos. One sec old videos. That's it. I've worked out the naming system. You can't stop me now. Right, white feign armor, uh, light armor bonus, and then greater soul gem. Ten armor skill points. Craft that bad boy. It was worth it. That should hopefully be good. Right, let's get the... Uh, get spooky super skin. shattered $50. Oh. That moment when you get sad when you save Skyrim because the series is done. <laughs> Does that, uh, look, we... I, I am genuinely going to be sad when this series is over, but I'm sure we can find something fun to replace it with because it has been a one hell of a brilliant ride to do with all of you, and I've absolutely loved it, and I wouldn't change it for the world. It's just been such a blast. Um, oh, my God, we can get some really expensive enchantments with speech bonuses. Let me do that. Okay, let's get a comment. Disaster Master bonus. LP Super Shattered $110.85. I've heard that if you don't beat it before the day's end, you won't be able to drink <gasps> your chati no! until the next release of Skyrim. Well, that's a 100 dono from... 100 chuff dono from Disaster Master LP. Um, I... I Look, if, if I don't beat the game... God, I know I can't make the bet that if I don't beat the game, I won't ever drink Yorkshire tea again. I can't do that. Well, until the release of the next Sky, until the next release of Skyrim. Well, Todd might not release another version of Skyrim. That's the problem. It's entirely possible he won't. What am I to do then? I'm just buggered. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> oh no. Uh, let's see. What have we got here? What's the most expensive? Shouts. Shouts might be a good one. Uh, shout power is... Oh, resist frost. Yeah, let's get frost resistance, because we might... 
actually face, say, like a dragon with, with really, like a frost dragon, then that could actually be useful. Okay, there we go. Enchantment up to 48. Let's now enchant some earrings. Uh, you deal 10% extra damage with two-handed weapons. Okay, now let's just do frost resistance using these petty soul gems. Craft. And then lesser soul gem. Steel earring. Uh, pick an enchantment. Resist frost. Bam. Craft it up. There we go. This is how we grind our, our enchantment levels. We're doing it the scummy way. Enchantment up to level 49. We should even get a level up off of this bad boy. There we go. Bam. Okay, final thing. What have I got? I can enchant the in green white scarf. Oh, I've got nothing for that. Okay, the, the hood. Articulation. Lesser soul gem. Bam. There we go. Level 50. Four. Oh, that wasn't enough to level up. Oh, beans. Have I got a perk point lying around? No. Okay, I'll just have to go find a trainer then. But my goodness, we can do this. We can do this. Uh, Matt the Hunt says, The weather in England is almost Scottish at the moment. I hope the roof holds. Yeah, it was a concern. Luckily, they, they did patch it up when we had a relative span of decent days. Decent weather days. Mino, mean, Mino Moon, thank you for donating five gifted memberships. That's very, very generous of you. Thank you. If you received one, make sure to thank Mino Moon for their kind and beneficial donation to all. Um, right. Uh, let me swap around some of my armor. Make sure to put on my... do 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 my speech hat whilst I'm running around. And then, yeah, here's my new armor. So, light armor skill is increased by 10 points. That's pretty good. Where's my light armor skill at now? Okay, so it's up to 81, which isn't bad. We might want to sink another point into this. Um, because, realistically, my armor stat is up to 146. It's not bad. We can survive, like, a, usually two hits, is what I'm going to say. Like, we're a... We're a two-hit kind of guy. A two-pump, two-pump jump <laughs> is another descriptor, I guess. Hello, are you Arcadia? No, you're not. You. You're not. How do you survive it getting dark so early? It's so depressing. Honestly, yeah, it, it is just an aspect of UK life, though. Um, that it just gets depressingly, depressingly cold. Mud Hopkins said my super chat didn't send. I'm sorry that's the case, but maybe it's a sign from YouTube. That you you just keep the money for yourself. Spend it on tea. Need something? Oh, Arcadia, I'd like training in alchemy. I think I can teach you a thing or two. L literally, if I give you 410 gold, that should be enough to level me up. There we go. There we go. Thank you, Arcadia. I now have my perk point to spend on my enchantment. Woo. Very good. All right, let me go have a little lie down in the guards' quarters. I say the guards' quarters. The free bed of Skyrim. Two pump tea chump. Honestly, I look if the if the mug is like a normal size mug, I can two gulp a mug of tea. Like I can I can smash those bad boys back like nobody's business. Thank you very much, everyone who liked the stream. By the way, that's uh, very generous. Right into the bed roll I go, phasing through the wall, seeing a little bit of the world. Sleepy wish time. All right, let us sleep until. I guess, hey, no, we need about 10 hours because we will wake up, do a bit of enchanting, but then we need the shops to be open so that we can sell some stuff. Spink Prime said, I spent money on Yorkshire Gold as per your sponsorship and I found out it to taste taste like black tea. Well, I mean, Yorkshire Gold is a black tea, so that would make sense. <laughs> right, we're going to sink some points into stamina. Perk point to increase. Right, this is where we sink our perk point into... Do, 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 do. Where are you enchanting? I went past you, didn't I? Hello. Enchantments are 50% stronger. Bam. Perfect. This is what we wanted. I'm really hoping that we can do something really, really stupid on this bow now. Oh. Do, 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 do. Excuse me, guards. An ego! Out the way! There is a need to push. We only have like 30 days to beat Skyrim now. I realize I've just slept another day. Oh, God damn it. Oh. oh, yeah, there's also new emojis. Good spot noticing them, Joe. Yeah, some of the emojis I need to get um, no backgrounded of. No background versions of because um, they, they should appear on the stream now when people do little donations and become members. I just thought it would be cute. Um, 
Spiff, do you have a plan for finishing the game or just hoping things work out? Yeah, my plan is to basically get this bow up to where I need it to be and then absolutely um, smash out um, the the levels effectively. Like, I just need to... Um, I need to... I need to just, like, be in a position where I can reliably crush my enemies and then try and just curb stomp them. Kelvinil, Kelvinil, Kelvinil. Thank you very much for d gifting five memberships. That's very generous of you. Um, Green Joker says, have a bad memory, but did we ever complete the vampire quest that you looked for 20 plus minutes in the town you just left? Yes, we did spend 20, well, no, I'd say close to 40 minutes looking for a vampire and we did complete it. And I think we got 250 gold for the entire process. Um, it was relatively not necessarily worth it. Have I still got a greater soul gem? Yes, I do. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities. Yeah, that's what we want to see. It's not quite a grand soul gem, but I don't think you have one in your inventory. You do, but it's empty. So yeah, there's no way we're going to be able to get a nice grand soul gem. Right, excuse me, Farangar, get off the bloody table. Mum said it's my turn on the enchant. Jeez, there's no need to T-pose above me. But yeah, Mum said it's my turn on the arcane enchanter, okay? Oh, dear. Right, in we go. Do 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 do. In he goes Ebony Bow. Damage armor. Um, ma do I want to max out the charges? Yeah, I think max out the power of it, and then we can just charge it up ourselves. Um, so yes on that, and then one greater soul gem. Right, let's craft this bad boy. Enchant the item. Enigo's bow. Amadeus Stouffer super shattered ten dollars. Check the staff enchanter in Windhelm. It's very balanced. Check the staff enchanter in Windhelm. It's very balanced. Oh yes, we did walk past it. I did think about using it. It's in the shop of the man who was doing the um, the funky quest line. I actually don't know what the enchantment strength on this bow is. I guess we'll never know. I'm going to presume it's about 100. I'm going to guess 100 armor d removal is what it roughly works out to be. God, we've got some bone arrows. Nice. That's not bad. Um, right, let me um, let me quickly use this. Uh, do I have Lucian? He and Inigo talk to each other. No, I do not have Lucian. Um, I chose not to get him. Do I want to get the ethereal potion? I mean, becoming ethereal might actually save Why my life in the right moment. Yeah, let me make that. That could be that good. Would be amazing. And, and then amazing. I kind of just want some general, general poisons of damaging health. Destruction spells are stronger. No, just regular poisons. Uh, literally, I can just chug out a bunch of basic poisons. Nishard Wicks and Super Shattered, nineteen dollars and ninety nine cents. Hi, Mr. Oh Spiff. Just wanted to say I have been loving the series. Oh. You've been one of my favorites since I found the channel. Let's Thank get you. that roof done, yeah? I'll be watching with a <laughs> cup of tea today. Much love from the States. Thank you very much. Green for the Joker love from Super the Shattered, $17.94. It was arguably the most important quest, and here is 200 gold more. <laughs> the vampire quest was not the most important quest we ever did, but thank you nonetheless. I would describe the vampire quest as. Uh, mid at best i'm gonna make a couple of frenzy poisons because i get the feeling we might be able to use them on the forsworn that i know are going to be over by that tower um frenzy yeah yeah the frenzy potions reflect damage resist fire could be useful just in case we come across some dragons and i'm also going to get a resist frost because um we can maybe use this with the uh the, the little ring i made if we encounter something Right, fortify shouts. Yeah, no need on that. Fortify sneak attacks. We'll grab that. One of those should be good. And silence, water walking, restore health. I'll make a couple of restore healths. They are useful just in case, because you never know when you're going to need it. Okay, I'll make a bunch. There we go. Alchemy level 40 now. Four. Thank you, Prince uh, Alhorian, for donating to Fix the Roof. From a friendly South African coffee drinker. Uh, consider the donation refunded. You bastard! How dare you trick me with your generosity and then hit me with, hit me with your coffee drinking, you horrific individual. 
But yes, thank you very much for the money. I will spend it on tea. I uh, just got in. What's he doing? Uh, what's the next thing we'll be doing? Uh, we are about to sell some gubbins, and then we are going to be making our way to uh, the Blades stronghold uh, in the Carspire Ruins. We'll be taking the cart over to Markov and then walking over to the ruins, and hopefully we don't die. Hopefully. Uh, Jared in the live chat has just downloaded Civ 6. What's a few beginner tricks? Um, chop. Uh, use Magnus and chop, basically, because the way Civ 6 works is it's a game of snowballs, and the faster you can get ahead of the curb, the better, the, sorry, the curve, the better you will do. So, realistically, yeah, you want to get on top of, on top of the AI as soon as possible, and one of the best ways to do that is to uh, to yeah just absolutely smash them in terms of early early production from chopping down trees. It's worth it. Get the spellbreaker shield. We don't have time for this. We have to we have to focus on what's important: selling gubbins, making money, hustling, hustling and bustling. Actually, do, is there anything I have to sell to you? Welcome. What can I do for you? What can you do for me? So what have you got for sale? In my potions and ingredients? Well, rather actually, what do you want to buy from me? Hot beef stew, no, I need that, that's mine. Empty potion bottles you'll buy from me. Ingredients wise, you'll buy all of these salts. But I, I will keep the salts. Uh, you'll buy a couple of my potions. Not many though. I'll sell you the alchemy, uh, sorry, the magic potions, because I don't really need them. Solution of the Defender's nice though. And I'll even sell you my magic, yeah, these magic potions I'm not gonna need. Draft of Restoration I won't need. Potion of the Voice could be good. Yeah, there we go. That'll free up a bit in my inventory. Have you got any super strong poisons? And I mean, like, super strong. Uh, potion, potent aversion to poison. Reduces enemies' poison resistance for 50, by 50%. This could be good on bosses. Um, because some of them have a chance to, of course, resist poison. Lingering stamina poison, I don't think would have the best bet. Potent calm poison. This is good, because this could work on most dragons. Most dragons, we're facing are like level 10. So I think that's worthwhile. That's very much worthwhile. Okay, not bad. Happy with that trade deal, Arcadia. Yeah, that's right. Call me Fane. I also accept Fane Daddy. Ooh. <clears throat> uh, a person with a Cyrillic name donated 5 euros, which means I can't pronounce it or even fuck oh <laughs> oh my god of course of course yeah i was like oh easy yeah we have a potion to now fight dragons um speak of the bloody devil here he comes i'm not intending to die here we are not gonna die today i we are not gonna die today i'm not gonna die he's level 30 exactly Okay, right. Well, we'll do our best on him. Whoop, he's up. And away. Your big smelly gas bag. That's exactly what he is, Inigo. Big stinky gas bag. Where the hell is he going? Is he just floating? Oh my god. He's just flying around up there. My arrow did not go anywhere. Yoink. Where's he at? There he is. Chat. Clench your butt cheeks. Oh my god, can I even hit through that tree? Oh my, do not kill the people of this land. That's my job, not yours. Ooh, ouchie. Oh, there was some fire on the ground, I guess. Woo! <laughs> it's like an AC-130 drive-by with this guy sometimes. Um, oh, he's up there on the roof. There we go. Not bad. Not bad, actually. A couple of bit, good bits of damage. I think our our corrosion to lower his armor does have a good effect because it means everyone else does more damage to him, uh, which stacks effectively really nicely. God, where is he gone? Ooh. He will die this day. There we go. Good hit. 1,100 health. Oh, wait. I realize I have the, um, I have my staff. What is my staff bound to? Staff of soul trapping. Bound that to four. 
There we go, because I want to make sure that we soul trap this bad boy. Critical strike, nice. Good damage. Oh, really not bad damage. Good damage, he's down to 556. Five, okay, I think we go for the soul trap when he's down to about... Whoop. No, you don't, you cheeky bugger. Oh, he's looking at me, I don't like that. Right, soul trap, come on. Dragon resisted soul trap. Don't you resist, you bastard. Don't you resist the soul trap. I need this. I need your soul. I need your soul. You bastard, give me your soul. Give me your soul, you... Oh, you cheeky git. Well, fine, I'll take it. Oh, my goodness. I'm annoyed I didn't get the soul. I'm really annoyed. Still... Dragon Souls are smelly. Come on, that soul gem could have been amazing. Dragons can't be soul trapped in this mod set? I guess not. I guess not. Oh dear. Well, that was a successful fight. Mental Shatter donated to say you've got this Fain Daddy Spiff. That's the titling I like to see. <laughs> the Spiff the Dovakin is the soul trap. Well, I'm the best. Thank you, Lucia. Good to see you. Honestly, Mister, have some gold. Thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. Exactly. I realized I did all of that without wearing my my archery improvement gear that makes me even better at shooting bows. You can't soul trap dragons, damn it. What's the highest thing you can soul trap again into a grand soul gem? Isn't it? Is it a giant or a mammoth? It's one of those two. Yeah, because realistically, if we can get a soul trap off, we're in we're in good money. Yeah, I guess you're right. We can't soul trap dragon. I completely forgot that. As you can tell, you play you play Skyrim with so many different mods and so many different over so many different years. Your warped perspective of reality crushes you. Okay, hello, Bellafor. Bellafor, what do you got for sale? Do you like bones? Yes, you do. Take my bones. Take my emerald. Take my flawless amethyst. Take these garnets. Take this ruby. Take these other garnets. Thank you for being such a good... Oh my goodness, I've literally bought your inventory. Got anything else that's useful that I could use? Necklace of mending? Nope. Ring of health? No. Health regeneration? Uh, some rings? Okay, none of this seems particularly useful. Beyond, I guess, this helmet having... In oh, it's in comparison to my um, my current armor, isn't it? Because I'm wearing the headrest. Uh, any good arrows? You've got bone arrows in your inventory. Bellafor, I'm going to be buying those bone arrows. They could be super useful. <laughs> I will also get some fire arrows, because I think they'll be good against the Forsworn. Um, yeah. Good trade. Good trade with you, Bellafor. It was a pleasure. It was a pleasure, indeed. Let me have a chomp of my honey... No, actually not, honey. Baked potato. Yum, 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 yum. Uh, Green Joker says you're currently up to a total of 13 arrows with 8 hit arrow hits in a row. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get 50 arrow hits in a row. Um, yeah, I might struggle with that. What shout have I got? I've got marked for death as my currently marked shout. Uh, I'll spend a dragon soul on become ethereal. Let me unlock it. But yeah, I think mark for death is definitely the best because it lowers armor, which of course increases damage done, which scales with our bow that now also lowers armor. We just got we've got a big vibe going, big old long vibe. Hey Spiff, can you fill a grand soul gem? Uh, you can fill a grand soul gem by soul trapping a mammoth. There we go. Unfortunately, I'm pretty sure most of the mammoths outside of White Run we've now since murdered, or should I say liberated from their physical form. Uh, Fusro Dar Gladys at the dragons, the ultimate attack. Honestly, sending an immortal corgi flying at high speed towards a dragon, like a cannonball, might not be a bad idea. Bow and arrows the yes, uh, Try to keep up. yeah, honestly, come Lydia, you do need to keep up. Right, let me uh, see if the Khajiits have anything. Oh, what do you got for sale? Uh, aversion to poison. 
Uh, calm poison, command poison. Command poison might be useful on the Forsworn. I will yoink that. Uh, do 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 do. Lingering stamming the poison. Lingering poison. Regular poison. I mean, this isn't bad. This does 40 damage, basically. So I'll take that. Um, potent corrosion. Reduce enemy armor rating by 200 is incredible. Reduce enemy weapon damage by 40% also is wild, but that won't affect dragons because they don't have weapons. Um, they're just, you know, they're 60 damage poison. Yoink. Yoink indeed. Uh, what have I got to sell? You can probably take this amulet of Akatosh because I'm not going to Shiro use it. Sage. Take this. Super shattered fifty dollars. You oh seem to need God. more power. Have you tried making some Yorkshire tea gold? Thank you for the incredibly generous half hundo. Have I tried making some Yorkshire tea gold? I have not tried making some Yorkshire tea gold in game. Um, but it might save my life. It might. You never know. I'll get rid of this silver ring of frost resistance because it's not as good as the other one I have up here. I'll get rid of this gold necklace as well. And I'll get rid of this earring. Uh, do, 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 do. And this other earring as well, because they're just not very powerful. Good stuff. George? Oh, yeah, this is George, the toy. Thank you very much for the half hundo, though. That's incredibly generous. Chat, round of applause for the incredibly generous donation. And also, a round of applause for me, because I managed to kill a dragon. Let's not forget that. Let's sell those sapphires. I think it could go. It's a bit heavy. No, I'll keep it. Alright, sweet. Side. Away we go. Away we go. Oh yeah, we've got to go over to Markov, haven't we? Um, Lydia, pipe it down! I'm Daddy Fane. I'm allowed to bump people. Bump, bump people, bump people! I'm not, I'm not trying to bump people. Uh, Bjorlum, I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Please take me to Mark. Is it Markov? I've got to double check. It's got to be Markov, right? Yeah, Morphle is the Run stupid back, one. We'll on. God, I swear if I go to the wrong one, I'm going to be really pissed. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's the dwarven one. There we go. We're good. We're safe. We're safe. Giving up the ghost said, I came to the stream late, so I'm half an hour behind. How's the near future? Love your stuff, Spiff. Near future is looking good. We killed a dragon. And haven't died yet. It's gonna go well. Right, we've arrived. It's very cold here. That's not a good sign. What time is it? 8 p.m. Oh, God. I mean, rational me says we shouldn't continue on this quest and instead we should rest up before pursuing. But I I think we need to keep going. I Because time is so limited, in my opinion. We just kind of have to keep fighting onwards. Okay, so we don't need hard to detect while sneaking. We want more damage while sneaking. So 12% more damage when we're sneaking. And then what is my other earring? 7% hard to detect. Let's make that 6% more damage when sneaking. Um, let us pop on our ring mail. Hat. Yeah, okay. I think I've got all of my best gear on. Let's get to work. Um, right behind you. I guess potion wise, poison wise, I do want my level 20 command poison. Well, let's sort by value. Um, potent aversion to poison, I want to favor that. Potent calm poison, I also want to favor it. And the dis not disintegration. Where's the. Where's the disintegrate? Where's the super crazy disintegration poison that kills their armor? Where the hell is it? Oh my god, I swear it was in here. I best not have sold it. Did I buy that poison and then sell it back? If I did, I'm going to be quite annoyed because um, I'm a melon, but it should be in here somewhere and I just can't find it. Okay, here we go. It's probably in the corrosion pile. Uh, nope, here it is. There we go. Corrosion poison. Lovely. Give that a favourite. Uh, I've been meaning to ask, how do you make your tea? Uh, it's quite easy. I have a kettle. I boil water and I add water to a tea bag that is in a mug or a pot. And then I let it steep and brew, give it a few stirs, and then I might serve it on its own. I might add some milk. I might add some honey. It's all good fun. 
I also think I should probably open up with the bone arrows as opposed to the ebony arrows because we're going to be if I remember correctly when we arrive at this location it is immediately into fighting a dragon although we're not at that location yet so we're over here in Markov, so we've got to walk over and down the main road back towards Whiterun. So we'll follow this road over the bridge in the stones. Away we go. What a quest. Oh, bird's nest. Yoink. Oh. Do you have to put the toothpaste... Uh, do you have to... Do you put the toothpaste before or after the cereal? I'm guessing by question by that question you don't mean am I putting toothpaste in my cereal? Um, but usually I would I would do brush my teeth after I have cereal, right? Because things like milk and um, and cereal often have natural sugars in them, so it makes sense to do it after. I feel like that's just logic. Um, there is actually the temple that we're eventually going to be coming out of, but yeah, we just got to get around to the other side of it. Skiva, Skiva. Hello, Skeevers. I don't really want to waste arrows on them, so I'm just going to rely on an ego to finish them off. And Gladys. You go, Gladys. Yeah, battle Gladys. Go. And Lydia just swings and misses, like always. Classic Lydia. Good job, Gladys. What is this? Argonian? She's a dead Argonian. Okay, interesting. Oh, did I remember that I can... I think I can wear a hood under this. Yes, I have got my hood on. There we go. Nord Raven hood for the extra 10%. Oh, Spellbreaker can and will block slash nullify a Dragon Breath attack. Um, it might in the base game. I don't trust it in this mod pack. That's all I'm saying. Um, most of the things that were horrifically overpowered in the base game are gone. Like, flat out, completely gone. But I need to put on my night vision, otherwise I am not going to be able to see. Right, so... Bridge here, and I'm pretty sure Forsworn over there, across the road, near where the mud crabs are hanging out. How much damage am I able to do to a mud crab? Well, I guess I can't tell because they only have 55 life, and I just one hit them. Uh, but I'm gonna guess it's not bad. Yeet! Uh, Lag Monster has never bought a membership and they're on their personal best of six months. I can't believe, Lag Monster, you've received six months worth of gifted membership. That is actually insane. <laughs> oh my goodness. Where's the rest of the crew? There they are. Did you guys run down there to try and fight mud crabs on my behalf? See, there's that dragon. There's that dragon. I knew we were going to run into it. Here we go. Uh, right. Okay, I can hide behind this rock, can't I? Yes, I can. How much life have you got? Okay, he's got 1,800. He's one of those dragons. Right, let us hit him with the... Where's my corrosion? Potent corrosion poison. I can get you. There we go, potent corrosion poison. I feel like my shout missed there. But if we're lucky, they should have about minus... 300 to their armor. Come on. Oh dear, that was a terrible shot. I feel like someone's do shooting magic bolts at it. Do, 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 do. Right, uh, can I hit it with a poison? Lingering poison, let's go. Oh my god, what was that swoop? Jeez. Don't like that. You are only meant to have one attack and it's meant to be ineffective. Okay, right, you're over there. I think you're fighting Esburn over there. Good hit with a poison. Put you in a 123 oh, super shattered twenty dollars. Hey Spiff, good luck on stopping the end of the world. Also, Thank you, Poochie. there's an exploit to smithing and the staff enchantment table in Windhelm if you want easy levels in gold. Oh, okay, that might be useful for easy levels. My only issue with easy levels is I'm concerned because the enemies scale level-wise. Uh, the enemies might just outscale me. But there we go. That is that dragon dealt with. Let me quickly swim over before I freeze. Quick, 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 quick. Quick, quick, quick. One dead dragon chat, and that was effective. Let me take these scales. Gladys, where are you? I need to carry my gubbins. I guess an ego can hold this. Oh, wait, no, here comes Gladys swimming along. 
Good girl. Oh my goodness, guys. We did pretty good there. Gladys, carry some bones. You're really good at this. Uh, dragon bones, dragon scales. Stolen emerald I had. I completely forgot I have that. God, I've got so much gubbins on me. So many good loots. Um, that was honestly a pretty good fight as far as they come, in my opinion. Uh, next up we have the Forsworn camp to deal with, if I remember correctly. Uh, but it shouldn't be too difficult. I think if we're able to use our poisons correctly and stand up on the hill, we should be successful. Hello, Esburn. God, he seems so happy to see me. Hi, hi, is that, is that you, the Dragonborn? I, 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 thank you for saving me from the Rift and Shoes. Man, you're so, you're so cool. I wish, I wish I could eat dragons like you. God, I just... It's, if, when I was younger, I, re, I remember thinking, oh, wouldn't it be, wouldn't it be swell if we had it, if we had a dragonborn? And, and now here you are. Can I, can I have some of your hair? Close. Let's, keep <laughs> let's keep going, Delphine. What is it? Um, let's go. All right, so Forsworn hideout up ahead. Let's immediately crack open a poison of command. There we go. Targets up to level. 20 are placed under my command for 30 seconds and of course because my poisons last for two shots my hope is that i can land that on two enemies and um we should have two force worn on our side which should help with the distraction process uh there we go young stew says spiff you don't need to make haste you still have time uh you sh you'll still have to traverse blackreach without the compass Honestly, that's one of the reasons why I've got to go fast. Black Reach is no laughing matter. Right, if I if I sn did a sneak attack, I would kill that person, but I don't want to kill them because I want them to be a distraction. But I can sneak on in. There we go, there's someone. Is fun, yes. Oh my god, I missed that. Lead on to Skyhaven Temple. Oh my god, I missed that again. Please tell me the poison is still active. There we go, that was Young a hit, Stu super and the poison $20. worked. There Spiff, we go. You do need to make haste. You still have to traverse Black Reach without the compass. Oh, you said you do need to make haste. You're right. I thought you said you don't need to make haste. Damn it. <laughs> I was like, oh, he's, he's so supportive. He's understanding. I think I could do it. But no, no, you just, you believed I'm absolutely boned. God, these for, this Force One camp's going to be crazy. Um, fun fact, guys, if you didn't know, did you know that the Falmer are actually blind and they can only detect you via sound, which is why if you have the light armor perks that allow you to sneak really effectively, you're pretty much invisible to Falma. Right, I think you're probably high level. Oh, that was just a critical sneak attack. I was like, oh yeah, I'll get a poison attack off. But no. I'm going to probably want to sneak attack you. Oh, that was so close. That was close. But yeah, we've really got to take out their mages because their mages will be really powerful. That was just... Really too far. Present ninety nine super so many twenty one dollars and twenty three cents. Listen, There's a Spiff, stupid amount I have of a proposition form. for you. That I'll give fifty memberships close. if you read all the names with your best Patrick Stewart impression. What? Okay, <laughs> few names, but it sounds fun. You'll give fifty memberships if you read all the names of your best, my best Patrick Stewart impression. I don't do a good Patrick Stewart impression though. My my Patrick Stewart impression is pretty bad. Good kill. Are they, is he aiming at me? No, he's not. He's aiming at my allies. Come on, stand still. Stand still. Come on, you'd be doing me a good favor if you could just stand still and take this arrow. Good hit. God, that only did not enough damage to him. The follow-up uh, missed as well. That's fine. My allies should be able to get that. Uh, let me switch to fire arrows because we've got some AoE going on here. Or lightning arrows could be better. No fire arrows for the AoE. There we go. It should hopefully make... Um, God, there's an ice elemental over there. What the hell is he doing? I'm going to guess you're all Forsworn. Good critical damage. Oh, that one just missed. Uh, do, 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 do. That one also just missed. Yeet. God, some of my attacks are just going wildly out of the way. You can tell I need, I've, I've had a week to like warm up, but still not properly done it. All right, let's finish you off, Mr. Range Boy. Okay, you're definitely not one of mine. 
Oh, you ran. And I missed, so that didn't matter anyway. <laughs> Come on, okay, right. Force Sworn down there. Let's try and get a shot on him. Of course he wiggles. Lydia has died! No! Oh, God, and Present99 gifted 50 memberships, so now I have to do Patrick Stewart impressions. Omega Dash, thank you for becoming a member. Bloody Eyes, thank you for becoming a member. Oliver Phillip, thank you for becoming a member. Wolf Adderus, thank you. White Shadow, Nina Lambridge, Michael Moser, Eben Krostia, Adam Briggs, Sparkle Fritz, Sands the Comic, The Human Turnip, Crazy Dread, uh, Taurus, Jan, Jacka. Uh, the names are going too fast. Stop talking in the chat. Stop saying F. Adam, Adam Lawrence, Ricky, uh, Adam, Andrew M, um, Matthew May, Hentai Tentacles, Demas Patama, uh, Alexander Muller. This is This is a touching moment because Lydia has died, and I have you to do Patrick Street impression, <laughs> and it's not even a good one. Thank you so much, Present99. That is stupidly generous, but Lydia is gone! Alright, let's kill you. Come on. The AoE of the fire arrows leaves a lot to be desired. Um, but, damn it, I can't believe we've actually just lost Lydia. What's that? Sneak attack, critical strike on Force One. Okay, that one did work. I think there's a Force One mage over there. There is. Force One Ravager, level 34. If I can knock them out, that would be great. Because I get the feeling they're probably quite a strong boy. Yeah, there they are. They're a mage. Oh, mages are the worst. That's another good hit, though. Another good hit. And another. They're slightly staggering. Oh, my stamina is not very high. Another good hit. Oh my god, we got them. Whoa. Uh, dead like dead forever? Yeah, Lydia is completely dead. Which is bad, because she was our melee fighter, and we actually do need them. Uh, melee fighters are super useful. You look like a Forsworn to me. I don't think you're Esburn. Unless you're a Nego. No, you can't. You, you look like a Forsworn. Is that a Forsworn there? I, I feel like that's a Forsworn. That was a force one. <laughs> oh my god. Um, oh my goodness. Where have, where are we looking for the last few force one? Okay, we got a bridge with one on him. Force one forager. My goodness, my arrows are just going over the top. Come on. Good hit. I've got iron arrows for some reason now. That's not very useful. Um, right, let's kill you. And just miss entirely. Cork bulb arrow. Bit of, bit of paralysis. There's another loot. Oh my goodness, there's so many Forsworn. It's nice that some of them have just gotten stuck on that ledge though. That's pretty good. I might be able to get their feet. Come on, let me get their feet. There we go. Oh my goodness. Are we eating Lydia? Eat her? Chat! She's been dead for like five minutes and you're just immediately asking if we can eat the corpse. Bunch of savages. I can't tell which one of those down there is my ally and which one is my enemy. That looks like another force one. Yeah, you're another force one, definitely. And of course you're gonna keep moving around so you're gonna make my life hell. Come on, stand still and take this arrow. Oh my goodness. Stand still and take this arrow. Stand still and take this arrow. Stand still and take this arrow. You are literally dodging. When, since when were they allowed to dodge like that? So, jeez. Did one of them just... I can't tell which one is friendly and which is foe. You definitely look like foe. I'm going to say your foe because you've got weird horns on. Yeah, Force One Pillager. There we go, another good hit on him. That one was actually a successful paralysis hit. If I can keep those coming. Oh, those are actually just missing. Like on, there we go, another one hit by paralysis. Actually, I think I just hit Esburn in the back with paralysis there. Um, 
I mean, you know, that's still kind of effective. That's me doing my job a little bit. Critical strike on Delphine. Esburn resisted para paralyzed. <laughs> oh god, I'm sorry, Delphine. Half of these are hitting my allies, but that's, you know, that's the risk we take when we play with a bow and arrow. That was a good hit. And that was a successful paralysis. Can we follow that up? Yep, that's a critical strike. Oh my goodness. I know you said never again, but I just saw your Rust stream and the orcs made me cry laughing. Either way, that a person who would love more Rust content. There's a chance Flunky Flounder will get her. Jeez. Oh my god, Green Joker gifted 50 memberships as well. What the hell is wrong with you guys? Jesus Christ. Chat, can we have a round of applause for President 99 and Green Joker? Like, you guys don't have... You, that's stupidly generous. And you're spreading the gift of gifting. Which is way, in my opinion, like a super nice way to donate. Because you're, you're spreading the love. Oh my god. There's the cave. But, jeez, thank you so much. Um, that is incredibly kind of you. Incredibly, incredibly kind. Um, what is going on with this final fight? I need some help with this one. Prepare to die. I don't like, like the sound of that. Jeez, there's a lot of corpses. Let me see what I can help with. Cyrodelic spade tail. Oh, there's the battle music. Glory to the Forceborn? What? Which? Where's the Forceborn? You look like Forceborn to me. You resisted paralysis. You're almost dead. You look like Forceborn. You are. Right, there we go. <laughs> he went flying. And that should be the last force worn here. Damn you. They're dead. We did it. Four. At least I think we did. Where's it? Where is everyone? I know Lydia died, but where's Gladys? Who the heck is? Um, is there just a force worn? There's a force worn looter just swimming. What are you doing down there? What are you doing down there, little goofy? Little goofy guy. Just uh, hanging around. Don't call me a cat, that's rude. Oh my god, I need to find Lydia's corpse though. Like, where even is she? Inigo, where's Lydia's corpse? Where did she die? I even gave her some pretty good loot and everything. I might never actually find the body. Oh my god. Uh, where the hell are you shooting, Esbert? Oh, Green Joker Super Shattered $17.94. Clap clap, we did it. I never said arrows in a row, and you have not shot 50 arrows in a row, so ye. <laughs> Thank you so much, anyway, for the generous donation, even though I, I... You're right, I did shoot 15 arrows in a row. Oh my god, the garnet is good, though. Um, Jesus. Forsworn Long All Club. Stunning Bow. Where's that Forsworn Looter at? And Jesus Christ, present 99 gifting another stupidly generous 50 gifted memberships. Present 99, what is... Oh my God. Present 99 says, now all love around and no Lydia eating. We don't even know where she is. Exactly. We can't... How could we be expected to eat Lydia when we can't even find her body? I'm going to presume they're just running around polishing up the last of the Forsworn. Let me have a quick check up here. Because we killed one of the bosses up here. Here we go, the Ravager. Exquisite light armor. Yeah, look at all this crazy stuff. And I killed you with my fire arrows. That was good. Oh, a chest. Septim diamond ring. Oh, and some good emeralds. Where the hell is this last force worn? Is there a camp here? Yeah, jeez, there's a dead giant. What the hell did the Force One do here? Ice arrow, lightning arrows, Septim's bone arrows. Did I kill this? I don't remember killing this. Take the void salts though. Nice. Ooh, there's a little chest. Uh, we now have war. Present ninety nine. Jeez, Green Joker and present. Oh my God, you give another fifty memberships. Wah, 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 da, da, I'm on fire. Woo, woo. 
What? Hag Raven? A bloody Hag Raven? Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, Orcish Arrow. She's got a lot of health. Poison. She has the hots. It's a bloody hag raven, an ego. Under forty-four super shattered nineteen dollars and ninety-nine cents. Jesus, I know you said never again, uh, but I just saw your rust stream, uh, and the orcs made me uh, cry laughing. Either way, personally, would love more rust content. Oh god, we can't use a fire arrow. That's just gonna hit everyone. Staff of soul trapping. Do we get the soul trap off on her? Yeah, I think that is a correct soul trap. Jeez, although she is annoyingly healing. Let me get the bone arrows out. Yeah, bone arrows seem effective. Bone arrows seem very effective. There we go, she's gonna die. She's gonna die, and we'll get the soul. We got the soul. Jesus Christ. Black soul gem! Yes! And the bone arrows. God, that was actually a good kill. Green Joker, thank you for continuing this stupid escalation. Um... Okay, chat, I will actually talk about something funny that happened last stream that I said we were experimenting with. You might remember I said um, I was running at a normal rate on the stream, kind of like YouTube's default, to see what impact it actually had. Um, and the results were, um, basically... I, am glad you finally got to that I need to trade something with you. Um, uh, we made £220 by running ads on an average viewership of about five. 5,500 people. We made 220 pounds. And I would say that it impacted the viewing experience enough that I wouldn't do that again, um, basically. I, I don't think it was, it was nowhere near as, as invasive as say Twitch, but I, it's still not something that I, I thought was worth it, if that makes sense. But there you go. That's the results of the experiment. Thank you for participating with, uh, participating in it with me last week. That was very nice of you all. But yeah, just thought you guys might find that interesting and fun. Uh, what can I get rid of that I don't need? Horn of Jürgen. I could get rid of the Horn of Jürgen. Uh, oh god, can I give you the beacon? Oh, damn it, I can't. Take these torches though, I'm not going to need them. Okay, let us get back to it. Oh, jeez. Thank you very much though for the incredibly generous donation, guys. You don't you don't need to do, like, be that, that kind. Um... Jeez. Uh, Gnosis says, just put all your money on the corpse of Lydia, then you can eat the rich. <laughs> Is that the plan? Jeez, who's this dead stranger? Dwarven oil. We don't know what dwarven oil does. That's a that's an alchemy ingredient I haven't found yet. Dwarven oil. Let's just chug on oil. Reflect damage, fortify illusion, fortify magicka, and restore magicka. There we go. The more you know. Right, let's actually eat a meal. Um, rabbit haunch. Just get nice and fed. Oh, jeez. Right. Let's um, try and find Lydia's corpse in this massive mess of a base. There's a lot of loot around here, though. We've got to be careful, because we don't want to take too much stuff that we can't even carry it through the base. Who's this? Cyrodelic fur shield. Where's Esburn? Did Esburn die? He best not have. That'd be a bit, bit. An, oh, here's Lydia. I'm sorry. I know. Did for, a force one looter just said nah somewhere nearby? Oh, chat. Salutes in the chat. Salutes in the chat. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. All right, let's take all. Gladys. I need to carry something. I need to carry my burdens like never before. The the loot of Lydia. She was with us for so long and she did carry our burdens like no one has ever before. She was she will be missed, chat. She will be missed. Her continued presence, her witty banter, her ability to hold on to most of my gubbins. Gladys, are you not able to carry any more? I guess you're not. Are you actually maxed out in terms of... Yeah, you are. Thank you for carrying so much, Gladys. 
And here you go, I need you to carry some stuff. Oh my god. You give me best equipment, yes? I'm it's yeah, it's a shame to lose her in such a way, but she worked so hard for us. Did such a splendid job. We will never forget. How could we ever forget? Such a powerful, glorious beacon of happiness and kindness and brilliance, magnificence, you name it. And you go have the blade of white run, it's pretty pretty OP. Um what else do I need to give you? Because I am still overweight. Uh do 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 do. What else am I carrying that says? Did she have a bunch of ingredients that we didn't need? Or oh, was it arrows? Did I give her all of my arrows? Uh, no. What on earth am I carrying that's putting me overweight? Do, 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 do. I guess it just must be... I did give her a lot of my ingredients, didn't I? Take all of my bees. Take all of the butterfly wings. No, Inigo, you can just carry all of my potion stuff, okay? Someone's got her. I go, just take all of that. All of this gubbins. It'll put me under the carry weight limit. She was a good mule. She was a brilliant mule. Um, is she sleeping with her eyes open? Um, no, she's she's pretty pretty instantly dead. Like, there's there's no no doubt about it. She is giga dead and never coming back. Um, like beyond dead it did. True dead. Immense dead. Do I care? Did she have a bunch of books on her? No. Conjure Skeleton Minion. Well, that's just Lydia with extra steps. Oh, you can take these linen wraps and these ingots. There you go. And the plate that for some reason I'm carrying. Oh, there we go. That's everything. Jeez. Are you sure this is the right way? Are you sure this is the right way? As burn it best speaks, I've just lost I've just lost a brilliant friend. Rest in peace, Lydia. God, she's so rigid. Let's just push her in push her in there. This can be a this can be a resting place. Go on, in you go, Lydia. In you go. Come on, get in. Get in. Get in. Okay, right, we can't get her in. Um, you know what? That's fine. Forever encased in ice. Like Rear Admiral Mr. Snuggles Disney. Super Shattered Ten Dollars. Hey, Spiff, I found an exploit. Hi, if all Dewey manages to destroy Skyrim, it won't actually matter as Todd will just re-re-release Skyrim again next <gasps> month. Oh then my everything God! Will be back to buggy normal. Oh my God! What a what a valid point. Because Skyrim will never end. It, Todd will never allow me to lose. There will always be more Skyrim. Uh, but ultimately, no. If, if I do lose, that is the end, in my opinion. What is that? Is that a poison? Potent poison. Yep, yeah, that's a really good one as well. Oh, B. We shall remember Lydia for her noble sacrifice. Garlic. Do, 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 do. Where... I just want to double check basically that I've gone through all of the chests because now that we're a relatively high level there is a chance we can get genuinely good loot off of the uh, the chests that we find around here. Is there anything in here? Literally just a bedroll. Nice to know that we've got bedroll bedrolls though if we need to uh, rest up. Can I go up there? Yes I can. Up we go. Eat her? We can't eat her. We need a campfire for that and I don't think we have enough wood be wrong though what is this steel dagger of souls do i have enough to do a campfire let me check build campfire how much wood have i got in my inventory uh i need four deadwood or firewood okay let me try and cut some trees do 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 harvest wood chop deadwood need a woodcutter's axe damn it um have I got an... Gladys, have you got an axe on you? Nope. Inigo, have you got an axe on you? I hope this will be a mutually beneficial exchange. Um, you don't have an axe on you, damn it. So, how much... Kin You've got kindling, but you have no dead wood. Okay, so we actually can't even do the fire, which means I can't get the perk to... um to eat Lydia because we've only got three deadwood and we need four we are one deadwood short is that genuinely right yeah four deadwood uh, 
How annoying. We're literally, we're so close to having a, a campfire level up moment. Oh well, these things happen. Alright, let's go check the loot out. Just go around here, I want to make sure I've got everything. Jesus Christ, Green Joker, I've just noticed you gifted 3,000 sec. 3,000 sec. You don't have to be crazy to live here, but it helps. That's a lot of sec. Wait, is this firewood? Oh my god, in our time of need. In our time of need. The firewood to give us the ability to eat Lydia. It's a sign. Green Joker, it's a gift from above. Roof budget is now complete. Uh, honestly, thank you so much. That was stupidly generous of you. You don't have to be that kind, but thank you. Oh my goodness. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I, I naturally believe that you sent this roof in the uh, form of this lovely firewood. Green Joker, you bloody kind sausage. For mammoth steak, let's make a mammoth, and then cook it up. Okay, right. Let me uh, skills. Here we go. What do we got skills wise? Um, do I have any firecraft skills? Pokes Green Joker increase? super shattered seventeen dollars and ninety four cents. We have a worn out present ninety nine. Yeah, that was you and Green Joker. You and present are just downright insane. Thank you so much for your continued support. I mean, you guys have literally been here in almost every single one of these street streams. And it's madness. Thank you so much. Right, do I want Trapper? What about Beastry of the North? Yeah, we'll choose this perk, because I think it means we can fight animals a bit better. Okay. Wait, hang a second. No, we wanted Cycle of Life! Damn it, where's my last save? It's only here. After the fight. It's after the fight. Okay, we'll, we'll roll the save back. Because I do need Cycle of Life perk. Oh, my goodness. Spear from us feed. I'll do it. I'll do it for Green Joker. I'll do it for all that came before us. How's my inventory looking? Okay, so this is after I transferred the inventory, right? Because Lydia's empty, yep. Green Joker super shattered two hundred and sixty nine dollars and eleven cents. I can't believe that. Two hundred and sixty nine dollars. That's just like it's it's an absurd quantity of fiscal support. Absolutely stupid quantities of money. Thank you so much. Right, let me grab that firewood. Should I grab? Is that more firewood I can take? I might as well just take as much as I can, and give it to my companions to hold. Because, yeah, firewood is useful. Am I invisible? Yes, you are sometimes. Right, let's get that fire down. Present 99 super shattered $21.23. You, you are aware that, unlike some YouTubers, you actually seem thankful for all this. <laughs> it is refreshing, poor Lydia too. Give um, her a water grave when she is empty. Present that 99. sounded wrong, lol. <laughs> I'm not going to give her a water grave. Wait, wait, give her a water grave when she's empty. You mean after I've consumed her corpse, present 99. Oh my god. Look, the reason I'm thankful is because... Um, I mean, you guys might not understand basically how the donations work, but especially the memberships. Mental the members shatter super shattered ten dollars. She wasn't the worthy successor to Janessa, who wasn't the <laughs> worthy successor to Fandle. Poor, poor Fandle. We don't forget Fandle. One mental cooler guy shatter. super shattered two hundred and sixty-seven dollars and eighty-nine cents. Oh my God, Lydia, cooler guys here A fine today. vintage of flesh and blood, sadly lost to time. <laughs> Best served with the scattered remains of the savage lot called the Forsworn. <laughs> For a good second course, just consume the remaining Janassa you have left. She had a family, you know, a life, dreams, and you let her die. You have the power of God. I'm sorry. Yet you failed her. I'm sorry, one cooler guy, that I failed Lydia. She was important, but also, how can we forget Feindel? Feindel was so. such a hero. The hero of our time. The hero of our, our very important time. You received different buffs around friendly animals. Beast Whisperer, Belly Rubs. I don't think any of those are particularly useful. I'll choose this. There we go. I think that's most of the perks. Oh, wait, no, this one. Lumberjack, Expert Packer. I'll increase this because it lets me carry more stuff. Okay. Goat Stance. Oh, my goodness. Uh, one cooler guy, Green Joker. Like, you, you guys are stupidly generous. Uh, you guys... Never need to be this this kind, but honestly, all of the money that goes 
into this. We, we do our best to try and reinvest it. Um, I mean, I hope you guys have noticed that by the fact that we actually have like members videos now, which exist entirely thanks to, uh, to you. Um, because, uh, oh, wait, hang on a second. Is there a, potentially a glitch? There? Oh no, there's not. I thought there might be a way to uh, cheese the unspent fuel. Um, but yeah, we, we try and reinvest it as best as we can. I mean, in this case, reinvesting it into a roof, um, uh, because I ain't got a roof at the moment. How much carry weight am I on up to? Three, three, four, five. we can go up to. That's pretty good. Um, but yes, yeah, thank you very much. Um, as present, present 99, you're, you're very kind words by saying, um, that I, I seem to, uh, I seem very aware of how generous you guys are as opposed to other YouTubers. I mean... It's not even the fault of other YouTubers. It's just, it's very, it's very strange being in a world where people want to give you money as a way of saying, like, thanks for, for kind of like, I guess, the work we do. Um, and it's very unexpected and it's very strange to, uh, it's a very strange thing and it's something I've never been able to truly get used to. Um, but it's, it, it like I'm really happy with the community I have if that makes sense and not because of the money but because of the generosity like in instead of instead of like uh, the way in which you guys often donate money is via the medium of gifted memberships which like I get I, I don't know I get uh, let's say for every 10 pounds you donate I get seven pounds right because YouTube gets the rest for every seven pounds worth of gifted memberships you give I get you know, like seven, seven pounds. Well, well, for every ten pounds of gifted memberships you give, I get seven pounds. It works out the same as a super chat, basically, except other people get to see the cool members videos, which I, I enjoy that being shared around. So it's it's not just me being generous; it's all of you guys. It's a two-way street. The generosity I find, um, as it often is with humans. Yeah, the community is full of good people. Uh, it's it's a wonderful thing to like just. I like, for example, this coming month, um, we have the Jingle Jam charity streams, which I have to help out with and sink a lot of time and money and effort into, which is, is good fun. I'm always happy doing that. Um, but one of the things we, I have to do is I have to kind of like test um, a bunch of gameplay stuff. Esbone, can you get out of the way? Esbone, can you, you're just right in the way. Well, there's a looter right there. Critical strike. I'm too old for this. We're too old for this. You ran in like a lunatic. But yeah, like my community, uh, for example, when they when they heard that, oh yeah, I, I could do with a hand testing uh, some some stuff, they were like, yeah, yeah, sure, what time? Anytime. It's like, it's super fun just to be able to like, get people together and have them come together to help out and uh, just assist me with something super cool, like raising money for charity. It's nice that I have a, I have a community that can, that can do that. Amethyst, very nice. What have you got? Money, a briar heart, elven daggers, saucy stuff. Right, let's wiggle our way through. Oh, personal note, potion of the shroud. There we go, there's those ethereal potions. I do want to actually get them. Potion of, where is it? Uh, where is it? Where's my ethereal potions? Uh... I did make quite a few of them because I think they, they, they'll be good at getting me out of dangerous situations. There it is, Draft of the Shroud, favorite. Because um, yeah, if we get into combat and we basically need to uh, get away quickly. Oh God, fear poisons as well, these are all nice. If we need to get away quickly, then um, this is a really great way of, uh, of escaping combat. So let me quickly bind that to three and then I'll bind the poison to four and then this to five. Yeah, present 99 says, okay, I give in, eat her out. Oh God, whatever happens in the future, uh, do never change. Uh, this here is fun and so it should be. Yeah, honestly, um, it, it's it's really fun to be a streamer. But as you say, enough with the mushy stuff. Lydia is at least a frozen TV dinner. As promised, chat. Present 99 has given consent. Lydia must be chomped. Present 99 super shattered $21.23. Okay, I give, in eat her out, sneering face. Whatever <laughs> happens in the future do never change. This oh, here is fun and so God. it should be. But now enough mushy stuff. Lydia is at least a frozen TV dinner. 
Okay, so after we do this chat, we'll be distrusted among others for a long time. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, that's so horrible! What did we get? Human flesh? Alright, well we're gonna eat it, chat. I hope, I hope you're happy. <laughs> oh my god, we discovered Lydia causes paralysis and fortifies sneak. I mean, that's pretty on canon considering Lydia blocks doorways, literally freezing you in your spot. Oh my god, chat. There we go. One final farewell for our brave warrior queen, Lydia. Green Joker super shattered $17.94. <laughs> forever Hashtag fresh. forever fresh frozen, Lydia. <laughs> Look, fresh frozen. It's, uh, it's, it's the modern way of cooking, I'll have you know. Nom 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 nom. Chat, if you like Lydia's presence, you know what you can do. You can like the stream! Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, you don't have to. Uh, just if you want to. Um, but honestly, I was not expecting to lose Lydia to that fight, but... It's reminded me of, of the, how, how swift and fragile life is. We, we really do have to be careful when, when navigating this environment. You never know what you're going to find and what dangers lurk around each corner. Ooh, flawless diamond! Nathan Abel super shattered $10. Ebony I've always explained streaming as internet street performing. So super <laughs> chatting is a tip jar. So I never feel bad tipping folks like you sir who deliver fantastic content. Honestly, Nathan Abel, thank you very much. Uh, you, yeah, I guess you're right. Streaming is a little bit like street performing. I'm, I'm here performing in public, and this is a bit like a tip chart. The way I kind of see stream donations is, I, I, the way I perceive it is kind of like, you guys have seen hundreds of hours of my content, right? And so tipping one pound is kind of like, it's kind of like passing on the thanks. Well, not thanks. I don't know if that's the right term. Like, um... Uh, yes, these are Akaviri oh. symbols. Let's see. You have the symbol for king and warrior. And of course the symbol for dragonborn. Oh, That's God. the one that appears to have a sort of arrow shape pointing downward at the bottom. Okay. So I've got to work out the way this puzzle works. Um I cannot remember this puzzle. But yeah, it it's fun being a streamer. It's very very strange. How many of the companions did you eat? Only one. Only one. If I remember, is it, if I activate this, oh wait, I guess, do I want to go all Dragonborn? Yes, that's it, the symbol on the pillar on the left. Okay, literally all Dragonborn. Whatever you did, it worked. Let's see what those old left in our Okay, that worked. If I remember, there's a spider we have to fight through here. Um, Lucas Japan donated to say, as soon as I join, we're eating the companions. Hope you have some tea at least. Well, how else am I meant to wash down Lydia unless I have a nice stew? Oh my god, it's this thing. Right, if I remember correctly. Lucas Chepin super shattered ten dollars. Awesome, as soon as I join, we are eating companions. <laughs> Hope you have some tea at least. Yeah, of course we've got a cup of tea. It's important to stay hydrated when you're eating human flesh. Um, now I'm going to do whirlwind sprint. That worked. We should be careful here. We should be careful here. Jesus Christ! How do we? Well, you'll cross once it's safe. Oh, I've got to pull the lever, haven't I? Um, be careful. Is it become ethereal? I think that's what I have to do, right? How do I how do I pull? How do I pull? Look, activate chain, activate chain. Whoa, there we go. Super it shattered yes, sixty nine dollars. Nice. Sixty nice. nine lords nice. shut up and take my money. Oh like toxic. that smash button. Oh my <laughs> Lydia does look good enough to eat. Like that smash button. Oh okay. Two things. Toxic, thank you all for coming back to these streams. It was really nice to have you around last last time. Um and then also, secondly, thank you very much for the donation. And thirdly I know you're American, but this is one for chat to throw out because maybe you have it in America as well. Ha have you ever eaten Smash? Smash is in the the like powder powdered mashed potato that you add boiling water to. Because I have Skyhaven Temple. Here we go. This is looking funky. Funky Munchkin. Yoink. 
Amulet of Akatosh, Amethyst, Scroll of mm. Burden. Remarkably well preserved. Whew, but that was an incredibly nice gift chat. You best all say nice in return. And Visual Tank, thank you very much for gifting five memberships. Honestly, 235 new members in a stream is is wild. Uh, Mango's not going to believe me when I tell her after the fact. <laughs> she loves it whenever we get members because, like, that's that's her job. Her job is to entertain you guys. And she's almost finishing editing the, um, the, uh, the next uh, members video, which is a Skyrim one. It's very, very fun. Right, I've got to uh, release some blood on this seal. I'm pretty chuffed. We haven't died once this stream. We've gone quite well. Instant potato sounds hecking nasty. Um, honestly, Smash, when you're like camping, is really quite quite nice. All right, into the into here we go. Fun fact: when I first played Skyrim, this is when the game hard locked me because I had well soft locked me. I had to save like four hours before this. But Delphine turned hostile, and I had no way to de-aggro her. So the entire game was ruined, and i it took me like another two months before I wanted to play Skyrim again. Yeah, into the Blades Cathedral we go. Red Giraffe, thank you for the donation, saying, Hope your weekend has been splendid, Smith. It's been really good. We've had some family round, um, which was, was nice and enjoyable. Um, I'll have a chat about that whilst we do the word wall. But yeah, we had uh, some of Mango's family came over. Went to some Christmas markets, took Georgie the Corgi around to do some fun days out adventuring. So yeah, it was just a nice chill weekend. Hello Troopin' in chat, I'll be having a fun time. Mango Smash? Mango hates Smash. And by Smash I mean the, the mashed potato. Um, she like genuinely detests the, uh, the, the like mashed potato, uh, pre-made mashed potato. She, she just hates Blades not the best. Dragon's Bane. Not many people will see it. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it. Mace Etiquette. Old Record. I'll take that. Why not? That'll be fun. Blade's Greatsword. Chest. Amulet of Stendar. Don't need any of that. This heavy armor is fun, but no. Actually, do we... Stendar. Yeah, we'll take it. Fine, because we can disenchant it. Um, actually, no, we can't disenchant those. Whew. It's nice to know that some people have eaten Smash, and I'm not the only one. Um, a Smash is incredibly, incredibly salty, vaguely mediocre, but r very unique. Goodness, there's a lot of chess around here. Nice. Gold. Gold. Lots of pelts. What are you? Blade's robe. Uh, robe isn't a bad idea. But I'll just be yoinking your gold for now. Actually, wait. Were they gloves? These gloves look like I might be able to use them. Alongside these gauntlets. Maybe. Ooh, thief backpacks. Uh, I don't think Inigo actually has a thief backpack. Well, it has a backpack full stop, so I might grab one for him. Yeah, let me grab one for you. You want to talk? Let me give you something. I will bear your burdens gladly. Yes, carry my burdens, please. Now that Lydia's not here, someone's got to do it, and that's gonna be you. There we go. He's got a nice, cool new backpack. Welcome, Keith Betton, for being a member and a Queen Bay. Queen Bay. But yeah, I've had a nice weekend. Chat, how was your weekend? I know it's been like Black Friday, which is always a unique time, especially if you work in retail. Apologies if you do. Well, I guess not apologies. Um, I just, I hope it wasn't unbearable. Um, I hope your your time was not horrifically arduous. All right, let me quickly hop on down whilst Esburn does his monologuing. Here is Legacy Evolved said I loved having Smash when I was a kid uh, with those meat hot dogs. Oh my goodness, yeah. Like when I was growing up, when my dad cooked, I mean, cooking is a strong word. The two things he could do well was smashed and sc smash and scrambled eggs and sausages. So <laughs> whenever it was just him and I camping, yeah, it was, it was smash, scrambled eggs and pot noodles. God bless pot noodles. This is the symbol for shout. 
Uh, uh, Reginald Von Snufflepuff said, I spent time in hospital due to a nut allergy. I mean, it's November. Everyone's meant to have an allergy to nutting in November, but I hope you're doing better. Ian Hammond, thank you for donating £10. Say, you can't argue with the smash robots. You can't argue with them. They will smash you. I mean, if you've seen Robot Wars, those are some smash robots. <laughs> Very smash. Damn it. You ever heard of such a thing? A shout. Can knock a dragon out of the sky. Well, I mean, I got a bow that can do it, but no, I've never heard of that. I guess there's nothing for it. We'll have to ask the Greybeards. I hope to avoid involving them in this, but we have no other choice. Okay, I'll ask him if he knows. Good thing they've already let you into their little cult. Little cult? They're not that culty. They're just up on a mountain and they're all dudes and they have long beards and they don't wear shoes. Okay, maybe it is a cult. Um... Right. They're going to do their thing, and I now have to go up to the throat of the world and hang out with the Greybeards. Uh, but before I do that, I'm going to wander out here onto... Um, Pippin underscore North the super shattered $20. Hello, Pippin North. The best Brit around. How's the world turning? How's the world turning? World be turning good, in my Ian opinion. Ian super shattered $12.17. You can't argue with the Smash robots. There you go. You can't. As I previously mentioned. This is such a lovely outlook. Like, it's a really nice view on the world. You've got the dwarven ruins over there. You've got the city over here. I mean, or at least I think that's the city over there. Which we do need to head back to because, realistically, we're going to be buggered if we don't. Is there a fast way down here? I don't think I'd take to. I don't want to risk dying. Oh, I, don't, I really don't want to risk dying. It's too, too risky. Can I... Is there a... Safe path. That's not a safe path. Right, we'll go back through the mountain. Well, through the temple. Do, 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 do. Richard Gouda says, I'm still in the hospital watching yet another stream. Luckily, I'm back from the 1800s and not dealing with leeches anymore. Honestly, I've... In my in my youthful youthful days in the uh, the 16th century, those leeches, ho, ho, ho. They were... They were spicy. Spicy leechins. You know, it's when I hope you're hanging out on these cold chairs by yourself having fun. Because <laughs> I ain't sticking around, old man. I'm back into calf spire. Oh, use the shout. Chat, you're right. What a great idea. Let's use the shout and fall off. Gonna use my shout, fall off a cliff, and not break my legs because I turn into a ghost temporarily. Just like those girls on Tinder, I can ghost you real easy. <laughs> it's super effective. Allow me allow me to do a one-for-one -one recreation chat. Okay, so um uh, you're you're wandering through, you're having a pleasant chat, and then um, then you just uh, God, there goes an ego. Um, you're just like you, you're chilling out, you're having a nice nice conversation, everything's going good, and then just all of a sudden you're like, oh yeah, by the way, I collect Warhammer figurines. Later, sucker. <laughs> We're free! <laughs> and she's gone! Oh dear. Honestly, what you want to do, chat, is find um, find yourself ma uh, a mango because she, she not only assists with the collection of the Warhammer figurines, she paints them. She straight up paints my Warhammer for me because I cannot paint to save my life. So that's, that's my advice, chat. Good luck. I wish you the best of luck. All right, let's wander back on up. We could really do with a new follower now that we've lost Lydia. We really could. Oh, more junipers. These juniper trees are actually really worth it because we can get um, fortified marksman ingredients from them, which is super useful. So let me grab as many of these as I can. Go grab. This is really, 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 really useful. I didn't even know where juniper bushes were located in Skyrim until now. 
The more you know. Rescue Penguin Super Shattered ten dollars. Dance penguin. Monkey Dance. I will Happy dance. to catch you live. <laughs> I spent ten hours of my life watching you play Civ yesterday. Oh JK, wow! Our great second monitor content. Josh Strife Hayes would be jealous. Honestly, uh, second monitor content is king. Thank you very much, Rescue Penguin. And by the way, I love your name. I think that's very fun. Um, yeah, so about the 10-hour Civ thing. Um, chat, uh, do, are any of you in the live chat, do you have YouTube Premium? Because um, this is very important as I kind of, I need to test something. And the only way I can visibly test it is with um, effectively all of you guys. So do do you have YouTube Premium? Chat, Is uh, do, do some of you have it? Trust me, this is of genuine critical importance um, for statistical analysis. I've got Ninroot. Have I not analyzed Ninroot? I need that. Void Salts. Do to do Hawkbeak. Frost Salts. Briarheart. There we go. All good ingredients. Yep. Okay. Quite a lot of you do. Okay. Brilliant. Okay. Those of you with YouTube Premium, um, what I want you to do right now is go over to the, the 10 hour Civ video on my channel and on your phone or your YouTube app, you should have the ability to download. Just click download in like free, uh, 144p. It should be like a 900 megabyte file or like 600 megabyte file, depending. Um, but download it in 144p because I think it, it still adds um, watch time. I think it still does, regardless of you having not watched the video. So if all of you could just download it, Thank you very much. Um, it's a, uh, it's, it, it might do something very silly. If not, it's good to know that it doesn't. So, thank you very much. If you can go and do that now, that would be brilliant. Um, it, you will be helping with a future video that hopefully will be ready soon. Um, explaining the modern YouTube algorithm. Already downloaded it. Okay, Justin, if you could then undownload it and then download it again, because that's the next step. After you guys download it. I'll remind you in about an hour's time and you're going to delete it for me and then you're going to download it again because I think it might reset it again. Oh, hello. Have you got a letter for me? I no, no. Come back. Come back. Learn, exactly. Ah, ah. Come back. He's busy. He doesn't want to chat with me. Fine. Do I want to go into Markov and... Um, do I want to go in and see if there's a new follower? This is probably a good idea. Download it now. Done. Thank you so much, chat. You're incredibly generous. Helping me with YouTube exploits. You genuine heroes. All right, let's go into Markov and try and save this lady in the uh, the market. Straight away. Go, come on, come on, come on. Saved him. Did it. I did it. I saved your life. I did. I was gonna bring this to my sister. Oh, a silver emerald necklace. Nice. Oh, good. No, I'm not chatting with you. I don't care. I don't care about your note. Oh, Warstag in the inn. Warstag in the inn. Okay, right. That that'll be who we'll try and grab. The silver blood inn has plenty of strong drink and clean drinks. Are you Warstag? No, you're some guy. Lundva. No. Will you help me raise a flag for my dear departed bride? Who are you? May he find peace in Sovngarde. Hmm. Who are you? This one looks like they can handle themselves. Yes. What about yes. you? I think Vorstag. There we go. Consider yourself hired. Fantastic. We've got a new friend. Vorstag, guys. Oh wow. Um. Gustolfus Adolphus donates five dollars to say, Spiff, who is your favorite Warhammer faction? Uh, probably the Tau, just because they're really visually distinct from most other factions. Um, Present 99 uh, super shattered ten dollars and sixty one cents. The following buy of memberships is in the name of that green joker he wanted to but could not, so here it is to keep the universe balanced. Oh my Sneering god. Face. Present 99, the following buy of memberships is in the name of green joker he wanted to but could not, so. Here it is to keep the universe balanced. Present 99, what are you about to do? What are you about to do? <laughs> My god, something terrifying might happen, chat. 
Pretty much anything to what have you got for me? Hunting bow of weariness? Mm, that sucks. Any good armor? Vanguard, Vanguard armor of eminent destruction. Spicy, but useless. Your light armor doesn't seem to be much better than the stuff I currently have on. Bow-wise, Dwarven Bow for 50 damage. Hunting Bow of Wariness, not the best. Uh, yeah, I don't think you've got anything useful. Your arrows aren't even overpowered. Jeez, yeah, your inventory sucks. You don't even want any of my stuff. Let me know if you need something oh my goodness. Natasha Wright super shattered $12.17. I collect, paint and play Warhammer 40k Space Marines. Which army do you play? Also as Mango on YouTube. <laughs> I will have a cup of tea in remembering Lydia. Thank X. you, Natasha Wright, for generously donating in remembrance of Lydia. So I collect, uh, I collect Tau, and Mango, um, uh, Mango paints my Tau in gold, uh, which is quite crazy indeed. It's very, very crazy indeed. Uh, it's I really like the design, but it is quite eclectic. If you look on my, t if you look, if you Google the Spiffing Brick Gold Tau. Or golden tower you should see a picture of my army um, or at least it's a little bit of an old version it should be quite a few few years old um but thank you for pouring out a tea in lydia's name mango doesn't have a youtube she had a twitch where do you want to go uh but yeah right where are we gonna go not white run uh, is is it fast to go from white run up to the throat of the world well we went from rifton last time so let's go from white run this time um, <laughs> oh dear. Red Giraffe says, have you ever traveled to Latin America? No, I actually haven't. Um, it is it is on my list. I'm not too sure where I'd go in Latin America, though. Um, because I know there's lots of like really touristy places. Part of me wants to go visit some of the ancient like uh, Mayan, Incan, Aztec. Lauren D. Super uh, Shattered, $12.17. Uh, excellent. Vorst Tag will be a tasty snack when he inevitably no! perishes. Lauren D. No! Vorstag is Vorstag is a tasty snack visually. Where is he? Did he not follow me? Oh no, here he is, here he is. Vorstag! It's our guy, it's Vorstag. Um I'm gonna have to give you some loot. Give a holler! If you need anything, give Vorstag a holler. Present99 said, uh, you can't do it, YouTube is blocking you. And Green Joker says, both me and Present99 tried gifting another 50 memberships, but apparently there is a limit because YouTube won't allow us. There is. You are not allowed to donate over a set amount uh, per, um, per, what is it? It's not like per month, but like uh, per, um, per like, oh God, this man's going to have a chat with me, uh, per week or something like that. Which is good. I think it's important because you don't want people to donate too much money. Thank you, Sold. Is this the letter of inheritance? No, it's not. Letter from Fonar. Where the hell is my letter of inheritance? Letter from Fonar. Where the heck is Fonar? Seventy-five septims. I hear you're becoming quite the adversary of the Forsworn. Oh, they're just happy that I killed some Forsworn. That's quite nice of them, actually. Gladys, I need some stuff from you. Green Joker Super Shattered $17.94. <laughs> Both me and Present99 tried gifting another 50 memberships, mm -hmm. but apparently there is a limit because YouTube won't allow us. There is indeed a limit, and you have discovered it. Um, yeah, YouTube YouTube has a limit in place, as I was saying, um, which I think is good. I know Twitch... I don't know if Twitch has a limit, but it's important because... Similar to other like addictive things, it is addictive to give people money, right? And I think it's similar to like gambling. You you need to have you need to have like stop points in place. I guess if that's the correct term, I'm not really sure. But yeah, you you want there to be um, you want there to be a reminder, um, like a blocker to to stop you from going potentially beyond what you're actually comfortable with in hindsight. Do you want Dragon Bane? You, you probably could do good with Dragon Bane. I'm not going to hit a dragon with a sword. I'm not an idiot, but I believe in you. Uh, you failed to find the tower pictures. Okay, I'll, I'll bring them up at the end of the stream. I'll bring them up. Also, jeez, we're almost at 3,000 likes on the live stream. Thank you so much, guys. Jeez, you kind souls. Husky Max 2011 Super Shattered $12.17. 
Hello, Spiff. Jake Hello. from Bournemouth. I love your Skyrim streams. Jake from Bournemouth. I watch these for hours at a time. Oh. I was just wondering what your favorite Daedric card effect is and oh. why. Hashtag boo the Webberjack. Honestly, I, I boo the Webberjack as well. I think mine is the uh, the mask. Uh, the mask is my favorite Daedric artifact. You will know the mask I'm talking about. I don't need to explain more. I just think it's good fun and silly. Um, but Daedric artifacts have always been such a fun, crazy little staple of Skyrim that I really, really enjoy. Um, I don't think I need to do a resupply on loot because we're literally just heading up the, the mountain and then back down again. So, yeah, we should be okay. Right, which way are we going to head up the mountain? Let me look at my map. Uh, I mean, we could go up from Riverwood or we could go across from Valfheim Towers, which I think is how we're going to do it. Let's go that route. Come on, gang. I've got a horse and I'm afraid you don't. But thank you, Jake from Bournemouth. Um, that's very, very generous of you. Bournemouth is a place that I have never been to in the UK, fun fact. Yep, there you go, the more you know. What mask? You know the mask. You know the mask. If you don't know the mask, you haven't played enough Skyrim. Chat, stop giving it away to them. Stop giving it away. They, they, shouldn't know, they, they should know what the mask is. This is the Skyrim test. Ah, oh, dear. But yeah, chat, thank you very much also for hanging out with me this evening. It's it's just nice having you guys around here. The fastest is climp right. Climp right after the... Oh, climb right after the bridge. Climp right after the bridge. <laughs> yeah, the fastest way up the mountain is just to climp up. Climp up the mountain. It's uh, it's actually a uh, Swedish Swedish uh, mountaineering method, climping. Uh, you can climp in many different ways. You can climp with your family as well if you're into that. Oh dear, is there a fight going on over there? There's a fight. There's some skellies. Why are there a bunch of skellies just fighting someone? There's just, yeah, there's just random skeletons. There we go, I got them. What the hell are these? Okay. Just a bit of Skyrim. Skyrim doing Skyrim stuff. Jeez, this new guy's real slow and I can't even remember his name. What's his name again? Vorstag, that's it. Vorstag. More like slow stag, or more like vor stagnant. Am I right, guys? Am I right? <laughs> Hit me with a high five. Okay, right. Um, I think enough people have probably downloaded the uh, the civs, the ten hour civ six video. So if you've downloaded it now, now remove it from your downloads. Don't download it again immediately. Just remove it from your downloads because you're gonna have to wait a bit for YouTube to detect that it's no longer downloaded. But yeah, basically my idea is I think if I analyze the retention statistics after this it's entirely possible that it's going to have accidentally rejigged the retention in a silly way a very very silly way james thank you for your donation saying been a fan since 2019 thanks for all the fish so long and thanks for all the fish to you as well good sir it's been uh honestly thanks for sticking around for so long james that's a bloody long while Necromancy stone? No, the necromancy stone isn't good. Uh, the necromancy stone is uh, pretty weak. Um, it basically is you can summon an additional conjured minion, but of course, because I'm not exactly using conjured minions, there's no benefit of the necromancy stone. Okay, we got some giants here, and I'm pretty sure they're on my pathway. So I'm going to get up to a nice position on them. Giants are something we can definitely soul capture. Let me see. Okay, I'll add some poison. Let me get the soul trapping stuff. There we go. That's a soul trap. I don't think he knows where that came from. No, he didn't. He didn't. Let's get him. Soul captured. That's a soul captured right there. All right, let's get the next one. All right, he's soul captured. Come on, aim, 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 aim. Oh my god, he did. He, We're not in stealth anymore. Damn it, okay. Uh, watch out! Watch out, Volstag! Watch out! Please do not die, whatever you do on your first outing. We got him. Whoa, that could have been dangerous. Good job, gang. Two. Two good things, though, from that. 200 gold, nice. Strange rock markings. Giant's toe will take that. Oh my goodness. Good looting. Good looting. 
And two soul gems just from that is really, really worth it. Orcish arrows are nice. Orcish heavy blade is not for me, but the sapphire is good and the bone arrows. Good stuff. Oh, and giant's toe. Don't mind if I do. Um, dried frost Miriam. Oh, I can't harvest that for cheese, can I? Where's their chest? They normally have a chest lying around, right? Oh, and they've got a cave. I bet there's giants in there. We are not messing with that. Anything up here? The cheese? The mammoth cheese? Okay, there was... It turns out, yeah, there was nothing up here. That was excessive, but we did get two soul gems, basically, and that is always worthwhile. Always worthwhile. Get Spooky Super Shattered $10. Get spooky! Has YouTube Thank ever you messaged you about breaking their things? Has YouTube ever messaged me about breaking their things? Uh, yes, yes they do. Um, I have quite a good working relationship with YouTube. Um, Todd, who is the algorithm and the person on Twitter known as Creator Support at the moment. Um, yeah, they are, uh, wait, no, sorry, Creator Outreach. Um, they, they're good good people. I often like will throw things by them ahead of time. If there's anything too egregious, I will, um, I'll always let them know. Um, and by too egregious, I mean like, Stuff that could land me or YouTube in legal trouble. Um, I'll give them a heads up because, yeah, they, they don't want to be, you know, destroyed. Um, and I don't want them to be destroyed Colin either. Colin Bailey twice super shattered $10. Been playing this pack and am basically finished with the main story. Oh, Your yes. largest barrier will be that Alduin is effectively immortal while the dragon priests are alive. Seriously? Oh, no. I'm not looking forward to that. But thank you very much, Colin, for the, uh, the good news. Well, I say good news, the bad news. Wait, can the gate open? Open the gate, open the gate. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, open the gate, open the gate. You were good at opening the gate before. Just open the gate again. I want to go through the gate. I want to go through the gate. Come on. There we go. Right, now I guess we just hang a right after this. Um, no, it is, it is up from the tomb. Yeah, it's up from the rock. Okay, I guess I just try and I try and scale up to the right. Chest in the cave, go to the cave. Okay, fine, we'll go back in the cave. Spiff skips free cheese. <laughs> How could you skip free cheese? I accidentally pressed E on the uh, the horse and the gate at the same time. Come on, gang, through the gate we go. Yeah, there we go. No, the gate closed on me. There we go, open up gate. Fantastic. Okay, so I guess we also have to scale up there to the, uh, up the mountain somehow, which we'll, we'll manage, I'm sure. Horsey, can you do this? Yes, you can, Horsey. Very happy. Tim Smith said, high five for Vor Stagnant. Thank you very much. I'm glad you appreciated my joke and my humor. It's very, sometimes you require a high IQ to understand my jokes. Um, aren't Dragon Priest technically dead already? There we go. Checkmate, Aldrin. How can you be buffed by the Dragon Priests when they're not even alive? No, the cave is dangerous. But they said. Ooh, Mango says, do I need some money so I can ask him if he wants tea? Type tea in chat if you wish to help me, chat. Chat, type tea so I understand that Mango is trying to offer me tea. I mean, that kind of defeats the purpose. But Mango, yes, please. I would like a cup of tea. I would very much like a cup of tea. Right. Golden Rock Cave. Let's give this bad boy a try after I uh, just have a chomp on a mammoth steak. Yum, 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 yum. Also, does my bow need charging? Yes, it does. Right, let's give that a charge. Greater soul gem, lesser soul gem. Doesn't need anything too crazy. Uh, Green Joker donates 200 sec to say, Mango asks if uh, if you want tea. Also, I thought of a solution. Present 99, we can exchange Super Chat uh, the exact amount it requires for 50 memberships since Spiff receives the same amount of money. Super Chat seems to work still. How are you guys still able to give me money? What is wrong with you? You shouldn't be able to. What the heck is in here? Please tell me there's nothing alive. Okay, no, this all seems to be dead stuff. There's a cow. Oh my god, there is just a chest here. Chat, you were right. There's literally just... A completely chill chest. Greater soul gem, coin purse, knights of the nine. Chat, this chest is amazing. Most of the time when you tell me to go in a cave, it's a terrible idea. What a great cave. What a great cave. Vorstag, you like it? You like the cave? Some bones. 
some bodies, some skellies. And what's over here? Nothing. Is there anything down here? Also nothing. What a great cave! 10 out of 10, chat. Wood cave again. Green Joker super shattered $17.94. Mango oh, asks goodness. if you want tin. Also, I just thought of a solution. Present 99, we can super chat the exact amount it requires for 50 members since Spiff receives the same amount of money. You don't super have to do that. Seems to work you still. don't have to do that, Green. You, you, neither of you have to do that. You've been stupidly generous already. You, you, I'm, I'm, you'd like, you don't need to. Thank you so much for your generosity. All right, am I climbing correctly? Well, I'm definitely not climbing correctly, but I am climbing. So I guess that is kind of working. It's a little bit janky, but, but, up we go. The air is very cold here. Oh no, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We've got it. It is getting dark, which does mean it gets colder, but. I'm holding out hope. How am I going to scale this one? <laughs> this one might be a bit more challenging. Uh, up this one? Yeah, if we just hug this this gap here. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, 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 come on. There we go. Left a bit, right a bit, left a bit. Come on. Yes, horsey. My goodness. Queenie is one heck of a horse. Look at her go. Oh, my God. Vertical mountain horse, chat. She might be weighed down by heavy armor, but that is not stopping her. Look at her go. Shout out to the horse, chat. One hell of a horse. Right, this is the pathway. Yep, this Present is the Present 99 super shattered $212.29. What? Well, I won't be a spoil what? sport here. Well played at Green Joker. What? No. No. No, 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 no. Jesus Christ. Present 99. What is, what is wrong with you? In the nicest way, what is wrong with you? That's so much, that, what? Am I even going the right way? I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I think this is up. This kind of looks like down. Yeah, this is down, so this has to be up. Oh my God. Present 99. That is a stupidly generous amount of money. Thank you so much. Like, you... Jesus Christ. Mango, whip out the special tea. <laughs> whip out the special tea. It's a special occasion. Oh, my God. And, yeah, we did just phase under the terrain there. My God. Connor Brown, I don't know if you can, but give that a love heart. I don't know. I guess you're not logged into my account today. Oh, we're in a rock. I'm in a rock on a horse that is climbing up a mountain. Oh, watch it, horsey. All right, let's work our way across. I think there's, yeah, there's the temple. Okay, we're Richter almost underscore at super shattered ten dollars. It just works. Richter at it just work. It does just work. Look at horsey go. Is there terrain under here? Maybe. Maybe there is. Maybe this is terrain. But I I also think I'm underneath terrain currently. God, this is such a weird, weird mountain goat experience. Whoop! Ooh, that one's dodgy. That one is dodgy. There we go. This is a bit better. Thank you very much, Rick Tourette, for your generous donation. All right, can we climb up this? Uh, ooh, that was, that was risky. Okay, yes, we're almost up. We're almost up, horse. Jeez, Horsey Kins has done super CS well. CS Super Shattered $11.68. Donating from earlier in the stream was late, with two tips. First being you can do enchant the notched pickaxe for the special acid enchant it has. Ooh. And also creating the armor at the staff enchanter gives you 100 enchanting. Wait, how is that good? Creating the armor at the staff enchanter gives you 100 enchanting straight off the bat. Okay, that's really useful to know, CS. That's a super useful exploit. Thank you very much for your New Zealand dollars. And Green Joker says apparently there was also a limit of super chat. Um, yeah, there is. But thank you very much, you kind souls. Um, bloody heck, you two. You need to go and have a lie down. A cold, a cold bath, maybe a shower, a relax, a recuperation. Oh, dear. Jeez, I can't believe we climbed a mountain. 
That was very effective. Shane Armstrong donated 10 Canadian dollars to say I will share cursed knowledge from the YouTuber fandom sphere. The trick to more donation limit is to make a new account to donate with. But Spiff says don't. Please respect his wishes. Indeed, Shane Armstrong. My, my wish is to never exceed that limit. If you hit that limit, that's it. Be happy that you did something absolutely stupid. <laughs> but yeah, the VTuber community is wild though. Like, I, I like... I remember once I was like, oh, well, if I lower my membership tier to one pound, surely I'll have the most members on YouTube. And then I did some research and then I realized that, like, there are v VTubers whose base membership level is, like, four pounds and they have, like, 50,000 members. It's like, oh, my God, I'm never going to get close to these people. All uh, right, Anigo, I think you have, um, I think you have the, the horn on you. Je Jeff! Jeff! Jeff has become the first ever 100 stat donator member. Jeff, welcome. Welcome, Jeff. Welcome. All set. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. Uh, make sure to link your YouTube and... Um, yeah, link your YouTube and, uh, and Discord. Because you get a shiny roll. Right, let me grab that. Have you got the horn of Jürgen Windcaller? Who's got the horn? Someone's got the horn. I think. Ah, do I have it? You've retrieved oh, I have retrieved it. Yes, I have. Well done. You have do I get a cash prize? Titles. Come with me. I don't get a cash prize at all. That's useless. As How useless! All right, over we go. T tubers are no match for VTubers. Honestly, if I earn as much money as VTubers made, I would probably not stream out of fear that I would bankrupt my own audience. <laughs> I've Slender Man Super Shattered, $12.15. Where... Long time viewer. First time donation. Sorry, it has not much, oh, but you, you played classic games like mean? Majesty, Hero of Might, and Magic 3, etc. I have to ask, have you ever played the old Westwood RPG, Nox? Evs, how could you mean it is not... How could you... How do you mean it's not much? Ten pounds is very, very generous. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. That's very kind of you. But yes, um, I have played classic games like Heroes of Might and Magic 3. Did I ever play the old Westwood RPG Nox? I did not. Is it worth playing? Because the old Westwood RPGs are really weird and funny, I remember. Right, I'm now being gifted the full Fusrodar. Thank you very much for that generous donation, uh, Eves. And Ashley Osburn, thank you for gifting five memberships, you kind sausage. We would speak to you. We would speak to you, okay. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeard, but you are ready. I am ready, apparently. Ooh! Ooh, there was a bit of screen shake. Pran now, indeed. Pran now. They're just literally... They're ranting now. Spiff with an anime girl rig would be too powerful. Yeah, just get my character model and slap some big old jiggly fun bags on it. <laughs> Finally, we'll have enough money to buy a mansion. Oh, God. I don't think I'd actually want to live in a mansion. My dream house is kind of like... Four bedrooms, big garden. And I mean big garden, because, like, nothing is more fun than throwing a tennis ball for Georgie. She loves it. What's wrong with Spiss Roof? It had a... It, it started with two leaks, and then it became... There are holes in my roof. Be careful. And so, yeah, we had to fix a lot of the roof. There we go. We completed the horn of Jürgen... Jürgen Windwind. And now we can do the full... Yeah! Fuss Roda... Fusro Fusrada. Christina P says Corgi Sona VTube. No, no, we can't do that. Sky above. Voice within. Um, hello. Um, I need to learn the shout used to defeat Alduin. Where do you learn that? Who have you been talking to? He sounds like a really annoyed dad. <laughs> He's like, son, where do you learn that word? Did you learn that from Jimmy at school? Did you learn that? Did you learn that? You bastard. Have the blades been telling you? Have the blades been telling you how, how to eat dragons? Have they been telling you that? God damn it. 
Oh, we will not stand for this. Um, it was recorded on Aldrin's wall. Great, of course. Yes. They specialize in meddling. Oh, they specialize in meddling. Blah, 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 blah. You meddled in matters you don't understand. Aldrin's trying to destroy the world for goodness sake. Dragonborn from the path of wisdom. The path of wisdom to the path of saving the world. That's what they do. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Right, um... Uh, the blades just want to defeat Aldrin, don't you? What I want is irrelevant. What you want is irrelevant, oh dear. Was used once before, was it not? And here we are again. Yes. You considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated. No, Those he was meant to be defeated, and within 30 days, ideally. Of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end... So you won't help me. Rescue not Penguin now. Super Shattered $10. You, you should go recruit Ari. She has a lot of interaction with Inigo. She can be found Ooh. in NW from Falkreath. Also, did you disable being able to use travel packs to fast travel? They are pretty cheap. Hello, Rescue Penguin. Uh, yes, I did disable being able to use travel packs to fast travel uh, because I like manually traveling. It slows it down. Forgive me, I was intemperate. I allowed my emotions to cloud my time. Yes. Master, the decision whether or not to help you. No, it is called Dragonrend. We do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place do, 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 I thought you knew all the words of power. But not Dragonrend. And not, perhaps, only its creators ever knew it. But I, only Parthenax, the master of our order, can answer that question. You weren't ready, but... Thanks to the blades, he is our leader. He lives. In, he speaks to us only rarely. Only those whose voice is strong. Oh, there we go. We're going mind. up to the top of the mountain. Thank you, you very much, Gaza Dragon, for five gifted memberships you. and Coral Silverwind. Thank you very much. If you receive them, make sure to thank them, chat. Um, that's very, very generous of you all. Um, <laughs> yeah, I love messing with the Greybeards. Oh, I'm now allowed to take the stuff from their sanctuary. Previously, they were like, don't you dare touch anything. This is sacred greybeard property. But now, if I remember correctly, you had some swanky things over here. What do you got? Potion of extra health, yoink, draft of strength, yoink. Um, oh, and then frostbite venom. Always useful. And the merchant thing. Slaughterfish scales, glow dust. All of this is good. Void salts, sweet loot. And can I now sleep in the beds? I can sleep in the beds. That was the, that was the one thing that really miffed me off about the Greybeards was I had to come all the way over here and then they were like, no, sorry, you've actually got to walk back down the freezing cold mountain at night in order to sleep. Sorry, not sorry. Green Joke says, remember to tell Mango when you get your tea about the that we reach 250 members in under two hours. I will do. She'll be very chuffed with that. Isn't the mod that lets Parfenax live and you still do the Blades mission in this pack? Maybe. But maybe I just want to kill Parfenax anyway, because he's a horrific war criminal. Um, I'm going to need to eat some food that's hot, I think. Um, oh, wait, no. Warmth is increased by 50 points. Yeah, yeah, I'll eat hot beef stew. There we go. That'll keep me warm. All right, let's learn the, uh, let's learn the shout. Clear skies shout. Words. There we go. Words of power learned. Sky clear sky. Now that would be useful in the UK. I am sorry. Unlock. Unlock. There we go. And finally, unlock. Thank you very much, Owen Girl. Well, follow me, meow. Welcome back, friend. Thank you for gifting a membership. Oh, and you're giving me some souls. Oh, I already used them. Oh dear. Well, I hope you give me some souls back. But only for a time. God, you guys look like you're freezing to death. I best get a wiggle on. Well, I'm doing it anyway. Like Monster says, oh, no, so now we're against war crimes. Yeah, we're against war crimes temporarily. Um... When it comes to dragons, dragon war crimes are more intense than human war crimes. All right, let's clear those skies. Get a wiggle. Where did half my health go?
Let me get a wiggle on. Now, though, if I remember correctly, there are ice wraiths on this path. Ice wraiths are pretty bad indeed. Very, very bad. Uh, and also, someone did donate to remind me to take the pickaxe when I find it, which I will do. Um, if you don't know, there's a there's the Minecraft reference at the top of the mountain, the notched pickaxe, which I will try and get to. God, what lovely views we have up here. Skyrim is such a majestically nice game. Don't want to fall down there. Okay, you got rifting over there. Whoop! Oh, there's an ice wraith. Run, 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 run. There we go. This bad boy, I'm pretty sure, can still one hit me. There we go. It's almost dead. There we go. It's dead. Still some arrows. Oh, 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 oh! No death. Swift. Got to be swift. Like the speed. Ice Wraiths are the Cliff Racers of Skyrim. God, Cliff Racers. Now that's a throwback. That's a throwback, chat. Ooh! Ooh There's a boy coming towards me. He's a very grumpy little boy. There's a boy running at me. He's a big old frosty boy. Frosty the Frost Troll is a very grumpy boy. <laughs> he will kill you and eat your you in stew. Because he's frosty. Yes, he is. Mark Bishop, thank you for 20 gifted memberships. 20 membies. That's what we're going to be calling them now. Membies. And also, thank you, chat, for nearly 3,500 likes on a live stream. That's very kind of you, chat. Very, very kind of you. Jingle Jangle, thanks for becoming a member and then immediately gifting a membership. That's a fun name. I like that, Jingle Jangle. Oh, ah, it's an ice rave. It's an ice rave. Uh, allies, friends, kill it on my behalf so that I don't have to. God, they've got so much health as well. Uh, I don't think the bow and arrow is the best suited for this section. Jeez, you guys are going for it. Where's that ice rave? Can I even get a hit in? No. Honestly, that's good. Ebony arrow. Yoink. Maybe I need to switch to uh, ebony arrows, actually, because I've only got ten of these. There we go. Much better. Save these for a dragon fight. Whoppa. Aviva Devora, thank you for gifting five members as well. Uh, we are calling them members. I've decided. Um, that's it's now it's now legally required. Members. They're all members. Ah, that's cold. Shout. There we go. We're almost near the top. And Mango has brought me a kind cup of tea. Chat. Please say thank you to Mango for the cup of tea. Thank you, Mango. Say thank you, Mango. Chat. Say it. Do it. She got me a cup of tea. And this is a cup of tea for everyone because everyone benefits when I have a cup of tea because I drink it and it makes me happy. And when I'm happy, you legally also have to be happy. Them's the rules. What is that? Is there someone in there? Uh, no. Um, no, Georgie hasn't had a second breakfast. No, Georgie needs to be fed her second breakfast. Mango, I need to say, um, I was reminded to say this. Uh, we received 250 members in t under two hours, and we we're almost up to 300 gifted memberships this stream. We're literally seven gifted members away. It has been a ridiculously generous stream. Woo! And chat, uh, look at the chat spam. Thank you, Mango. Woo! Look at that. Yeah. 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 Whoa! Oh. No. What? That was. How was that so? No. No, that wasn't your fault. Oh my god. No! We had no deaths! No deaths, I tell you! Poke me, oh my goodness. You've been a member for 45... No! We're back here! Oh my god. Oh my god. I'll do the shouts and then I'll lose a day. 
Oh my god, Potato Butt, thank you for five gifted memberships, and Genosis, thank you for ten gifted memberships. You called it? How could you call it, chat? I was doing so well up until that point. At least now I know not to waste my dragon souls on this nonsense. Nave and Abel, thank you for ten gifted memberships as well. Ten membies. Ten membies. And Trolls Dicol Jol, uh, thank you for one gifty membi. That's very kind of you all. Let me grab these words of power. Oh my, can some poke me for gifting five membies? And Julius Piety for gifting five membies. You don't need to keep gifting membies. Rover 320 now. Bloody heck. Give me your souls. Use it well. Thank you. I'll do my best. Hashtag blame Mango. No, you can't blame Mango for that. That's not Mango's fault. That's literally me accidentally walking in a silly way. Right. Clear skies. We'll grab that. And then let's have a chomp on our hot beef stew. Uh, go into the MCM. Lose one day. The world will now end on day 58. Drop down a quick save and let's go. Let's get a wiggle on. Oh my goodness. Ooh! I thought I got rid of the frost. How? Potion of healing equipped. Did I drink it? Did I... Come on, drink the potion of healing. Potion of healing was equipped. Why don't I drink the potion of healing then? Ah, oh dear. Let me drink a potion of minor healing. Is it not letting me drink a potion of minor healing? I guess it's not. I have to probably have a weapon out for that. Yeah, I do. Thank you very much, Todiuchi Viversity. You didn't need to gift more memberships after your generous donation earlier, but thank you very much. Um, I never forget an amazing surname like that. 20 gifted memberships is stupidly generous. All of you, why are you so kind? I'm a normal human being. You don't need to be this... It's, it's raining membies. It's raining membies in this cold, harsh, frigid landscape. Look at this. Oh wow, look at that. There's a, uh, there's, there's a, uh, what is it? Winterhold? Over there? Not Winterhold. Windhelm, that's it. Winterhold's over the other side of that. In the abyss lands that I hate visiting. Thank you so much though. You guys are all membies. Everyone's membies. I swear like half this chat now is members. What am I meant to do with it? Whoa, there's the ice wraith. To be fair, I really like the world designing behind that. Because it's literally like you you can't hit for shit. How do I hit this? I give up. Oh, oh it's getting cold again. Right, can we can we fight that, Inigo? It's getting cold again. Inigo, fight that on my behalf, please. There we go. Whoop! Whoop, 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 whoop. Uh, ice Wraiths, by the way, can still pretty much one-hit me, which is why I'm trying to be careful with them. There we go, it's dead. Alright, let's switch to Ebony Arrows. And keep shouting away the, uh, the ice. Oh, and then, yeah, we have the troll over here, I remember. We've got to be aware of that. There we go, critical sneak attack, there we go. Now that we know you're there, suddenly you're not so powerful, Mr. Trolley. Oh, sorry, friend. Oh, he dead. He dead. No feasting on me today, Mr. Trolley. Ah, 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 shout, 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 shout away the cold. Shout away the cold. It's too cold outside for anything. I don't intend to die again. Not again. Alright, swiftly up, swiftly up. Oh my goodness. That was a big hit. Yeah, I know. 5.8 times damage. We... That, that was genuinely like... 500 damage? Close to 600 damage? Okay, there's another Ice Wraith here. Yep, there is. Okay, Nigo, can you go after that Ice Wraith? Because... I can't. That's just, it's a waste of arrows if I attempt to do anything there. Oh no, he's after me! Da, da, ba, da, ba, da, you back off. You back off, you cheeky sausage. Not today, I say. Yes, Inigo, use your blade. I will shout away the coldness. Ow, 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 I'm standing on the ice spikes. 
That apparently does damage to me. Good to know. Right, come on, chow, 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 chow. Come on, guys, kill the ice wraith. Whoppa. Better pop a save, don't worry, I'm dropping down quick saves like nobody's business. Where's that ice wraith at? Have you guys still not killed it? Okay, you know what, just leave it be. Leave it be, it's fine, we don't need to fight that. Todd Porter donates two Dularoos to say you're the Yorkshire Gold Tea of content creators. Oh, that's very nice of you. You're the you're the Yorkshire Gold of of live stream audiences, guy, guys. You're the best. Very kind, all of you. Right, do 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 do. Up near the top, up near the top. So we randomly died of cold, like just over there. <laughs> So I'm just going to keep shouting. Ah, that did work. It got rid of the cold blast. Okay, so that cold blast literally killed me in milliseconds. So Natasha Wright super shattered twelve dollars and seventeen cents. Natasha Wright, thank you, Mango. You are amazing and oh. a goddess to the amazing tea god of Skyrim. Natasha Wright, I'll make sure Mango hears that when she next comes up. That's very generous of you. Jingle Jangle says you can do it, Spiff. Save the world. That's right. I can save the world. Right, here's the top. I think this is... Here we go, here's Parfenax. Hi, Parfenax. Uh, I don't want to talk to you yet. I want to get the pickaxe. I want to get the pickaxe. I want to get the pickaxe. Leave me be. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? It's up here somewhere. Come on up. Up, up. I swear it's up here. Come on, parkour up. We're doing great. Oh, camera's gone funky. There we go, fix the camera. Oh dear. Up we go. Alright, okay, can I. Oh! Whoop! Can I have some corporeal, corporeal reality? Whoop the heck, -a Rudy! Do I have collision? Why don't I have any collision? Can I. Ha Todd, can I have some collision back? Todd, can I get some. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Todd, this is great. I'm going to have to toggle collision and turn it back on again. Let me open up the console. All right, we'll collision off and then fly up to the uh, fly up to the top. Actually, did that that didn't do anything. Collision is now on. Feels like collision is not on. Todd, I'm telling you, it doesn't feel like collision is on. Because that now feels like it's enabled collision. Okay, let me try s sitting down again. Sitting and waiting might do something. Oh my goodness. Um, no, I'm still levitating above the ground. Oh, I'm going to have to do a save and reload. <laughs> I can't believe I'm hovering above the ground. Oh dear. We've been possessed by Lydia. Still targeted on Lydia. What do you mean? Is is that possible? Resting on the top of the mounting, add, adding that to the list. Look, flying above the ladding is ladder uh, fingers amazing. How am I targeted on Lydia? No, I can't be. All right, let me quickly back out to the menu and see if that fixes the collision box. Oh, thank you very much, Mango. Just press E. Well, I'll decide. You have an object selected. I see. I see. Lydia's collision was off. It was the curse of Lydia. That's exactly what it what makes sense. In the console, it says Lydia. Oh, I was turning Lydia's collision on and off. Oh, I see. Thank you, chat. Thank you, chat. That makes a lot of sense. It's fine. We'll just do a load in and a load out. Jackie O'Flaps donates $5 to say we do all of this because you're genuinely one of the best people on YouTube. You're such a wonderful human being. Please never change as Biff. Honestly, the only reason I do this is because I find my own videos entertaining and it just so happens that other people also find them entertaining. So I'm glad you guys um, glad you guys enjoy it. New shout unlocked. It is indeed a new shout unlocked. Right, chat, I'm going to take this loading break as an opportunity to go to the loo. So I'll be back in a millisecond.
Marco Super Shattered $11.02 Hey Spiff this series is by far my favorite. I never thought I'd subscribe to a YouTube and either donate through a super chat and here I am. Oh my also goodness. Also feels appropriate since I'm one of those using ad block for YouTube time. <laughs> oh, right. I'm going to have to probably reload Skyrim because I think that's a, that's a crash there. Um, at least I'll count that as a crash pretty much. Right, let me turn off the game. Um, thank you very much, Marco. Honestly, it's, you've, you've, it's an incredibly generous thing to... Um, if you do use ad block... Uh, which I completely understand. It's very, it can be really important in terms of security on lots of websites. Um, but yeah, it's very nice that you you took you, you took time out of your day to, uh, to to donate as a way of saying thanks for watching content without, I guess, contributing ad revenue. But yeah, that's really kind of you. Um, you honestly, the amount you donated is worth far more than any amount of views you can add, unless you're using YouTube Premium, of course. But like. It's, uh, yeah, that's very, very kind of you. All right, let me load up the game again. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> oh, it just works. Yeah, I know, classic Skyrim. Just works. Just get glitched into a mountain where you can't do anything. <laughs> and just levitate around like a lunatic. But it's, you know, it's Skyrim. It's, um, it's the brand new Skywalker uh, feature of Skyrim. It's the, the new Skywalk shout. Uh, paid for by the Disney DLC. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Did we fix Spiff's roof? We have indeed fixed Spiff's roof. Well, I mean, uh, chat, you you fixed the roofers and the roofers fixed the roof. I mostly just sat here and um, had to record my videos at like 10 at night after the workmen left. Actually, no, most of the workmen left at about 4 in the afternoon because the sun goes down early in the UK. So after that, I was then able to get my recordings in, which has been good. Does YouTube Premium make a big difference on revenue? YouTube Premium makes a, a like an insane difference on revenue. Um, I would say the if if you think about um, like okay, so for every thousand views, let's say a YouTuber gets four dollars, right? Or five dollars is actually a nice round number, yeah. So for every thousand views that are monetized, so for every thousand adverts watched, the YouTuber gets five dollars. Um, it's almost like for that, for for one, it's almost in order to get that much, well, to get five dollars from a YouTube Premium viewer, you'd literally need like ten YouTube Premium viewers, if that. It, it that like that's the difference YouTube Premium makes. It is incredibly generous to creators, um, and the best of all, it, you, YouTube Premium goes to channels that um, get demonetized. So if you watch creators that get demonetized quite regularly um, because they I don't know cover controversial topics or things like that, um, or they're just they they just have a format that doesn't really work for for advertisers, then they will still receive YouTube Premium revenue, um, and that goes a long way. Mm. Ah, fantastic. Oh. But thank you, Marco. That's the first ever super chat you've ever given to anyone on YouTube, and I'm grateful that it went to me. Um, right. Let us uh, have a chat with Parfnax. Although, actually, no, I'm back now. I should be able to climb to the top of the mountain. Sorry, Parfnax, you're still going to have to keep waiting. It's day 30. Oh, my God, it is literally day 30. I think we've only got about 28 days until the world ends then. Um... The pickaxe is up here, right? I swear it's at the top of the world. Lodged in a little rock. Could be completely wrong, but I'm like 90% certain it's up here. Do 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 do. Here we go. Uh, where's the notch pickaxe? It's up here. Here we go. The notch pickaxe raises the wielder's smithing ability and does five shock damage. <sighs> Smithing ability. God, if I can disenchant that, that would be amazing. An ebony ore vein? Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. Boy in Arcanism. Happy Saturday to you and Mango and Georgie. Thank you, Boy in Arcanism. Thank you for being a member. Angie W said, just joined the stream and I'm excited you hit your roof goal. It's not a big dollar bill donation, but here's some more because you and Mango are amazing. Thank you, Angie W. It's nice to be amazing. 
<laughs> that sounds so horrible. It's nice that I'm so amazingly incredible, isn't it? <laughs> oh dear. No, I just uh, I enjoy my life. I enjoy my job. I'm incredibly lucky. What more can I say? Let me mine up all of this ebony ore. This is good stuff here. Attack the nodes. It's much faster. I'm not here for speed. I'm here for immersion and environment. Plus, by pressing E, it gives me time to just drink my tea. Oh, a free garnet. Mm. Ah, it's important. Anyway, those of you with YouTube Premium, um, re-download the Civ 6 video. Or if you have it downloaded, uh, make sure it's deleted and wait a minute and then download it again. That's the 10 hour Civ 6 video. Please do this. It's important for my statistical analysis of YouTube exploits. Um, it is very important that I discover whether or not uh, this feature is as broken as I think it is. Malachite? Nah, I don't need Malachite. But sweet, sweet ebony ore. Not bad at all. Where is, where's my boy? Where's Parfa boy? Here's Parfa boy. What up Parfanax? More like Parfan nerd. Am I right? Am I right, gamers? <laughs> right, let's have a chat with you, Parfanax. Hello, hello. Drem Yolok. Yes. I am Parfanax. I'll tell you what, it's a bit strange having all of the 8K Who glossy character you? models and then going what back to, to, my <laughs> to Poly Parfanax. My, <laughs> my Strunma. That's what I should call my house. Instead of instead of calling my house my house, it's going to be my Strunma. My own mountain. My mountain. Right. Um, you're the master of the... I think you already know yes, who I am. Yes. Raza, you speak true, Dovakin. Forgive me. Folk, give me. It has been long since I held Tinvar uh. with a stranger. I gave in to Tinvark. the temptation to prolong <laughs> our speech. You call it a Tinvark. Um, I need... Oh, I like this question. Why do you live on a mountain alone if you love conversation so much? It's because he's a war criminal and he's scared of talking to people. Um, I need to learn the dragon wrench out. Drem. Patience. Patience. <laughs> there are formalities which... It's party snacks. ...at the first meeting of two of the Dove. Oh. Honestly, you really could boop his snoot. By long tradition, the elder speaks first. Screw tradition. Hear my thoom. Hear my foom. Foom, <laughs> my bones. Kinky. Kinky, Parfunax. Oh, he's got a nice flamey shout on him. Why do you intrude here if not for Tinva? Learn the word of power from Parfanax, right. So I will learn his his word of power, which is a gift, the fire one. Yol, understand fire as the dove do. The dove do, yes. You know, nine out of ten women recommend dove. <laughs> right, there we go. That's one shout do learnt. Not be afraid. Fast new. Let me <laughs> fast new. Okay, I'm gonna death by fast new you, Parfit X. There you go. He's only got 900 health. We could yes. one hit him. <laughs> yes, sausage, sausage lost mull indeed. Oh dear. Oh my god. It kind of sounds like he's getting off on this. I'm not the biggest fan. <laughs> he's, he's like, oh yes, talk dirty to me. Use that fiery tug of yours. All this way for Tinvak. Ah, yes, I do and seek a weapon against him. Um, do you know the dragon rend or not? Sorrowfully, no. Your kind, Jaw, mortals, created it as a weapon against Ooh, the Oh, exciting. Our Hadrime, our minds, cannot even comprehend its concepts. Okay, how can I learn it? Drem. All in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this thum? Uh, so I can defeat Alduin and save the... I need... To... Oh, wait. I like this world. I don't want it to end. But actually, I think it is I need to stop Alduin because that's online yes, with the stream quest we're Alduin. doing. Zemach, the elder brother, 
gifted, grasping, and troublesome, as is so often the case with. I know. But why? Why must why I stop him? Um. Stop Alduin. The prophecy says that only the Dragonborn can stop him. True, Costid. Do you have no better reason for acting than destiny? Um, I. Nothing but a plaything of Des, of fate. What better reason to act than to fulfill my destiny and my obligation to the YouTube clearly, live chat? Your sight is clearer than Oh, mine. this guy. Elder Scroll. Yeah, basically he's going to go tell me to go but, grab the Elder Scroll. But you... Come on, tell me. Do you know why I live here <laughs> at the peak of the Monaven? What, you name the throat what of the world? Name, throat of the world? Um, dragons like mountains, right? True. But few now remember that this was the very spot ah. where Alduin was defeated by Vaucht Unslad. Perhaps none but me now remember how. Mm, yes and no. Viknus Nikaron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was... Yes, yes. Basically, Alduin wasn't defeated. He was yeeted through time. An Elder Scroll. There you go. He used an Elder Scroll. He said the he said the name of the series. is only a... Which is why I... All right, come on. Skip along the deep lore. Come on. Come on. We ain't got time for this. Come on. So, what would you... Speak. Goodbye. I will listen. Learn the location of the Elder Scroll. Well, I know exactly where it is. It's over in bloody Blackreach. Goodbye. Our uh, par party snacks. Dude just hanging out on a mountain. Um, right. I now have to make my way back down the mountain. And, of course, I can't fast travel like in the base game. So, I've just got to walk back down and hopefully I don't freeze to death. Although, I think the sky now permanently clears and doesn't get cold again. I think that should be good. Do, 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 do. Come on down, we go. Oh, there's a goat. Which is the way? Which is the way down? And I guess this way. There we go, much better. Ah, oh, he said the thing. The Elder Scrolls! He said the line! He said the line, chat. He said Elder Scrolls! Imagine if, um... If because of the mod pack, the game was like, right, now you need to go and visit the Imperial City. And then I actually have to physically go and travel to the Imperial City. <laughs> I know the Broomer exists in this uh, this mod pack. There you go, let me give a nice clear sky shout. That was a good one. Yeah, so we could go to Broomer, but if I'm being honest, we ain't got the time for Broomer. We really ain't got the time for Broomer. Ice Pie, what have you got? Ice Wraith Teeth? Frost Ice Wraith Essence? Essences. Um, do do do. Scott Wiggum asks, Spiff, does YouTube take more of a cut from Super Chats or membership donations, which gives you more coin? YouTube takes an identical amount from both. Um, I, however, generally prefer um, YouTube Membies, as I will call them, um, because I feel that more people receive a benefit of the donation. But yes, at the end of the day, I receive the exact same amount of funds as a percentage. There we go. Uh, one, uh, one sec old videos. Actually, I'll wait for the AI to read out your voice, our lovely Aussie friend. Otherwise, I'm just stealing his job from him. So I'm not going to read out your donor. Got to wait for that. There's that ice wraith we killed earlier. I'll take his teeth. Yummy, yummy teeth. Whoppa! Spiff, collect the eternal snow. Oh, wait, is the eternal snow up there? I don't think I can collect that until I... Don't I need the bottle to go and collect that? Wasn't there something about ice cream from the throat of the world? If you activate a feral shout, you can jump down the mountain without taking damage. Which side of the mountain am I on? Uh, that's, this is the rift side. Ideally, I want to be on the other side of the mountain. The white run side. Can I get... Can I get the snow at the top of the mountain? Can I get that yet? Aren't I going to have to... You need the quest? Okay, fine. We do... Yeah, we could do that quest. 
And the old man should now be dead, so that'll be funny. One sec zero LD video super shattered. Where do I get the snow? Spiff, I don't have time for lore. Also, Spiff, I don't need to mine quickly. I need immersion. Need quest. Yeah, so we can't do that. Uh, do 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 do. Which one is it? It's not Legends Lost. I can't even remember which quest line it is. But yeah, we don't we don't have the next tick in the quest to go collect the snow, so there's no point in that. All right, let's work our way around to the front. Jingle Jangle, thanks for five gifted members. And yes, one uh, one sec old video said, Spiff, I don't have time for lore. Also, Spiff, I don't I I don't need to buy quickly. I need a version. <laughs> Look, okay, I. I, I usually skip mining, right, in video games because it's tedious, but it's fun here. However, because I've done the story a lot, I want to speed it along. I don't want... You guys have seen the story of Skyrim. You know what's up. You know what's happening. Also, I don't want to throw myself off the mountain because I've got to chat with these guys about the Elder Scroll. Hello. Tell me about the Elder Scroll. No, but he told me how to found it. Elder Scroll. Okay, go speak to the wizards. Thank you very much. May I receive the blessing of Akatosh? There we go. Nice. Um, nice. Thank you so much. Splendid stuff. What a good little adventure with the grey bids. They so grey. Uh, green Joker. Yep. I'll use the ethereal shout to, to jump off the mountain once I have my little nap. Is my plan, basically. I'll have my little little snooze in the grey beard. Beard beds. Yeah, do 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 do. Oh, and also I need some beer, don't I? Uh, mead. I don't feel stressed no more because Daddy's got some booze. Chug 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 chug. Uh, let's drop down a quick save. Have a sleep in a bed. Andrew Harb donates five doularoos to say cheers from Texas. Well, thank you very much for your generous generous dono. Let's have a little snooze. Okay, probably don't want to sleep until... Yeah, I think 9am should be fine. Oh, a dream! In the dream, you knelt on a dark volcanic mountainside. You felt out of breath, weak, and able to even take to your feet. You were swayed in an ashen wind. At your back, you heard a hooded figure gathering their voice settings the... Uh, gathering their voice settings, the air a quiver, their eyes lingering on you, awaiting. Okay, dream of Dov added. What the heck is the dream of Dov? Active effects. Dream of Dov. Shout recovery is raised by 5%. Okay, not bad. Not that bad. I'll take that. Right. Let me put this away. Do, 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 do. Uh, Green Joker says, be careful with the cooldown though, because if the cooldown runs out while you're still in the air, you die. Yeah, don't worry, I'm aware of that. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be careful. 28 days left. Jeez, we've only got 28 days left. Ooh, chat, do you think I can do it? You know I can do it. You know I've got this in me. I can do this, no problem. There's White Run. Okay, um, where's my ethereal potion? There it is, Draft of the Shroud. Um, let's drop down a quick save. Um, Potion of the Shroud. Yeet! <laughs> it's super effective. Quick run, 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 run. I can see the timer on it in the top right, so I don't feel too scared. Good jump, good jump, good jump. Right, quickly, come on, jump, 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 jump. Good ethereal-ing, good ethereal-ing. Good jump. Yes, you think I can do it? Go, Smith, go! Yes, chat! It's nice to have you on my side. Whoop! Whoa! Okay, that one was... Ah! Okay. Slightly too too swift on both of those. But one quick heal and that should all be fine. Right, we're not too far above Whiterun now. We might be able to drop onto the, the bandit camp that's around here. The overhang camp. Yeah, it's just over there. We should be able to glide onto that. There's Riverwood over there. In fact, we might be able to get onto this side of the cliff. Which, if we do, I can see a bear down there, which is a free soul gem. Well, free soul for enchanting. Oh. Come on, we got this. There we go. Nice cliff sliding. Nicely cliff sliding. Is the bear just... No, he's sat there. I thought he would... he's gone for a swim. All right. 
Let me get my soul trapping boy out. Oh, we've almost got no charges on soul trap boy. Oh, it does have no charges. Right, let me refresh soul trap. Greater soul gem is all I have. Oh, that's not worth refreshing. That's really not worth refreshing. Well, I suppose I've got four filled greater soul gems. Okay, fine. Fine, it's worth it. It does need more charges. God, that is kind of a waste. Right, there we go. Give it a soul trap. And then... God, how am I meant to hit anything with that in the way? Come on. Aim. Fire. Bear, stop dodging. Bear, almost dead. Bear, really almost dead. Come on, kill the bear. I'm going to have to soul trap the bear again. I'm going to have to soul trap the bear. One, once more. Why is he still soul trapped? Does this still count as soul trap? He's got a weird glow to him. Yeah, that worked. Soul captured. Sweet. Yoink the cave bears, ebony arrows, and the claws. Thank you nicely. Right, up and over we go. Let's make our way into White Run and try and get some loot smithed up a bit. Dodge these fishies. Goodness, this is quite a strong current actually for swimming. Fat Salad super shattered ten dollars. Finally, actually made it to a chairman meow <laughs> seminar for once. How to save the world and watch your friends die in thirty days. Yeah, honestly, that's basically what we're on. I mean, losing Lydia was rough, but Vorstag, he's a he's a buff boy. He's a very buff boy. He should be quite useful. He's yet to truly prove himself in the way that Lydia did, but. You know, if he can survive Blackreach, and if he could make it all the way to fighting Alduin, hats off to him. That that man's got got some cojones on him. Can I take the carriage ride, ride all the way up to Windhelm? Maybe. I think I can. Wait, sorry, not Windhelm. Winterhold. I always get the two mixed up. Mm. Yes, welcome to the seminar, Fat Salad. Thank you for your generous donation. Oh, oh, hello. For you. I have a letter here from Quintus, Quintus Navali in Windhelm. He said it's urgent. What the heck? That looks like that's it. Quintus no. Navali. Who the heck is Quintus Navali? Uh, letter from Quintus Navali. Reaping of the file. Okay, now he wants me to go. Wants me to go and get the snow from the top of the world. Well, you can just climb the mountain yourself, you lazy git. I'm only going up there. We're going to have to do the war council. Never again. What the hell, Scott Wiggum? Jesus Christ, Scott Wiggum. Sorry I'm late. What did I miss? You just missed out on the chance of getting a free membership from Scott Wiggum. Chad, if you received a membership from Scott Wiggum, give him a, give him a clap. Say thank you. That was stupidly generous, kind sir. Thank you very much. Oh my goodness. What do you got for sale? All of this is useless. Orcish Bow of Daylight. Also useless. Um, oh, let me have a quick wash. Jeez. My goodness, Scott Wiggum. Thank you so much. That's very, very generous of you. I like the fact that Nova Azrael has been in pretty much all of the chats as the only li uh, live mod and still has not been gifted a membership at all. <laughs> he has the worst luck imaginable. Oh dear. Boy in Arcanism. Wait, how much did I miss? You killed Lydia Spiff? No, Lydia was killed by the Forsworn and then we avenged her by eating her body at the behest and request of a lot of people. I can't even say it was a small amount of people that wanted us to eat Lydia. There was there was grand calls for Lydia to be eaten. Take a look. Oh wait, no, I don't want to talk just yet. Uh, do, 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 do. What do I want to do? I want to pop on my crown. Victory Reef. Gladys, you got the bones, haven't you? Yes, you do. Good girl. Bones. Grand Soul Gem. I need that in my inventory, not yours. Thank you. Uh, nice stuff. Right, we'll take all of that. I'm a bit slow. And then I want to chug my potion of the merchant. 
Where is it? There we go. Merchant potion. 10% better prices. Sweet. Rassad, I've got some stuff for sale. Take a look. You're going to want it. Uh, amethysts. There we go. They're pretty simple. 50 at each. Flawless amethyst. 87. Flawless diamond. Emeralds. Look at these. Premium garnets. Premium. Actually, I want to save some of these for some smithing, actually. I could do some good smithing with that. Um, anything in here I want to sell? Oh, the bones. I want to get rid of the bones. Please take the bones. Honestly, you can just take all of the dragon scales because I don't want to have to carry them up the hill. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Rissard. A pleasure doing business with you. <sighs> Gladys is a girl? Yeah, Gladys is a girl's name. How? Well, Gladys is very clearly a girl's name. Lydia carried our burdens, now we carry her. Yes, we do. In our belly. Lydia cursed Spiff to float at the throat of the world. Yeah, that, that was like some uncontrollable ga gas. That's how I'm describing it. Lydia gave us food poisoning. So we would just manage to project our fart ourselves at a perfect level and fly. Um, it's like a reverse shout. It's, it's an arse shout. <laughs> Wait, there is the mod. There's the mod when... Um, there's the mod where in Skyrim, instead of... Um, Instead of doing the um, the normal shout, you you bend over and just fart out of Fusrodar. I swear that's a mod, right? That's got it. That is a mod. I can't have just made that up in my brain. Let me take these iron ingots because I'll use them for some smithing. Oh wait, 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 wait! You have silver. Silver, please. Do 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 do. Nice. That'll do. We'll get some. Uh, we'll get some smithing done with that. If you need anything else, just ask. Actually, do I want to do my smithing after I disenchant the pickaxe? Probably, because it might increase my smithing skill, which might lead to some funny things. Your grandma gifted five memberships. Thank you, grandma. That's very kind. I didn't even know you had access to YouTube, but that's quite incredible. Thank you very much. Someone received a, a donation from your grandma. Say thank you to your grandma. Gladys was my grand's name. Gladys is quite a grandma name. Um, but then again, most... In a weird way, most people have a habit of naming their dogs after, um... After, like, their grandparents. Like, um... Old, old man names are quite common for dogs. That's all I'm saying. You know, you got your, like, your Benson. Your, uh... Your, like... Charles. I guess, no, Charles isn't really a name for a dog. Yeah. Alright, can we disenchant the pickaxe? Can we? We can't disenchant the pickaxe. Is that just not allowed to be disenchanted? I guess it's not. Yep, we're not allowed to disenchant it. Oh, what a shame. What a shame. Oh, well, makes sense. Makes sense. Right. Um, you want to try and enchant this one of these rings with fortify light armor, fortify sneak attacks with a Greater soul gem. 16% more damage. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. What does a... Um, what does a improved... Um, necklace look like? Because my current necklace is... Not the highest. Fortify archery. Fortify archery, 12%. I think that's a lot better than my current one. So I'll take that. And that's a level up. Where's my current necklace? Yeah, six percent better. So this is we basically doubled that. I will now pop that bad boy on. Where are you? There goes silver emerald necklace. Fantastic stuff. We are looking swanky, and I think my bow should be doing more damage. What's the bow up to? Seventy-three base damage. Very good. Ebony arrows doing ninety-three damage. Oh wait, hang on, we haven't even got our hat on. Let me pop my hat on. 8% uh, extra damage with that. So in total, 97 damage is what we're doing. Can I pop the gloves on without losing my gauntlets? No. Okay. Got to have those on. It's fine. Good to know. Oh, the zombie robots that I once had a, um, a pet chicken called George. That's quite a fun name for a chicken. But then again, you can give chickens fun names. I feel like some animals you can't. It's it's like it's not forbidden. It's just frowned upon, you know, to give a 
give an animal a funky name. A chickens, you can kind of go wild. You can call like a chicken Fumbles McNuttykins quite happily and people will be like, that's a splendid name for a chicken. But you call a child that and suddenly you're raising some eyebrows. That's what I'm, it's double standards, that's what I say. <laughs> Do I not get a letter of inheritance for Lydia? Nope, sorry. Damn it. What a shame. I feel like I deserve one. She carried my burdens. Oh my goodness. Necromantic amulet. Dra decays your body, strains your flesh, abates your mortality. What the hell is that? That seems crazy. And I'm never going to make it, but that does seem wild. Right, what's the highest value thing I can make? Emerald ring. Let's make one of those. Sapphire ring. Oh my goodness. Jeez, we can make a lot of these. Wait, I should have put on my pickaxe. Ah, the pickaxe. Uh, do, 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 do. I am in your Not way, pickaxe. Then, I am then. sorry. Yes, you are. Right, pickaxe on. Do, 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 do. Silver garnet ring. Silver garnet ring left. Splendid. Silver necklace. Amazing. Iron kitchen knife for four damage. Whoa, it's a strong one. Let's smith one anyway. Just for the hell of it. Live life on the edge. Live, laugh, love. Um, do I want to make some iron arrows? No. I'll make these iron kitchen knives. Yeah! You can't stop me. I'm smithing. I'm smithing, mum. Right. Actually, I can make a few more of these. I do want to make an iron kitchen knife. There we go. We did it. Awesome. Oh, can I also you smith up that ebony? Uh, ebony ingots. Here we go. There we go. Lovely stuff. Now, with those ebony ingots, I might be able to improve an ego's bow using the grindstone. Am I allowed to? Yes, I am. Superior bow craft. Okay, so I'm able to craft it up to superior. It's now doing 94 base damage. 94. Oh, I can improve Darwin's bow as well. Jeez, that's a good bow as well. And I can s improve the kitchen knives and they require nothing. Well, this is an exploit. I'll take that. Notched pickaxe requires ebony. Talented. Well, we're not doing that. Um, but geez. Uh, hello, Adri Adriana. Do you want to buy some? Do you want to buy some uh, some iron kitchen knives? They're superior quality. I'll have you know. Thank you. All right. What else have you got in your inventory uh, that you could sell me? How of restoration useless. Harder to detect. Well, that's nowhere near as good as mine. And I don't think any of this armor is good, except those gauntlets are quite nice. But for another time, maybe. Uh, any bows? Nope. Any arrows? Just dwarven ones, so nothing too powerful. Uh, do you want to buy... Oh, no, I don't want to sell you my ebony ingots. They are very much mine. But thank you very much. As you wish, my friend. Jeez, my bow is very jazzy now. Um, we are doing 114 damage per shot, allegedly. Let me fill this bad boy up with a common soul gem. Um, I think we need to... We could really do with collecting some uh, more more souls in the wildlife when we're on our adventures but i get the feeling we'll probably grab quite a few up near Winterhelm. sorry i mean winter hold god it's all the same hello bella four come by my crud oh a bit of this and a bit of that a bit of this a bit of that oh yeah you're trying to hit on me uh flawless diamond 291 take that flawless garnet as well soul gem fragments i might as well keep those they're useless but whatever um, what have you got? Do you want to buy any of my gubbins? I kind of want to keep the jewelry because I can use it for enchanting, but I don't have the soul gems currently to get a get a use out of them. Um, I don't really have anything else that you would want to buy. Have you got any more of those nice bone arrows? Yes, you do. Thank you. That's very nice of you. More ice arrows. They could be useful. They were okay. 
They were okay. Um, no, I think that's everything. Got pretty much everything I would want. Pleasure. It was a pleasure indeed, Bella 4. Right, up to Winterhold we go. Quite the trek we've got. Buy armor for friends. I already gave... Where's the new guy? Where's newbie? Let me pull up. There he is. Vorstag. Um, where is it? Let me... I need to trade things with you. I've given him steel armor, yet the boy is choosing to wear... What is he even wearing on his top? Is he even wearing it? I guess he's committed. He, if, okay, if I do shift, can I make you equip that? No, I, I equip that. Damn it. Um, you take that. No, he really doesn't want to wear the steel armor. Or use a shield. He just doesn't want to do that. You are a funny one. At least he's using the dragon's bane blade or whatever. I mean, I could enchant his gear, but pff, he's not worth... He's not worth the soul gems at the else? moment. He hasn't proved himself. That's all I'm saying. He's got to prove himself, and then I'll prove my worth to him. How's that, chat? That seems fair. Does hitting the shopkeepers reset their inventory? Not with this mod pack, no. Oh no, he's drinking from the bread cup. The bread cup. Sorry, nothing. They love drinking from the bread cup. <laughs> Those silly fools. Right, let's make our way up to Winterhold. I'll have a quick nap. Can you remove the item he used instead? It doesn't appear to show up at his inventory. Um, he he just really wants to use light you? armor. Which, I mean, I can understand. Light armor is pretty cool, but uh, I ain't giving him any good light armor. Because if I find good light armor, I'm wearing it. He can have my handy downs if he survives long enough, okay? Alright, there we go. Quick nap. Quick one hour power nap. To get sneak the level up in. Uh, stamina. Let's go. Perk point to increase. Right. Smithing, I don't think there's an advantage. And temper all items by one additional tier. Okay, we could. That would allow us to temper the bow a second time. That could be useful. Um, archery. How close are we? Zooming with a bow aims down time. We already have this one, right? Yep, we do. Um. 50 cent chance to stagger enemies, we have that. Critical attacks with bow do five times more damage, that's wild. Oh, we could increase the chance of doing critical attack damage. I think this is really good, because critical damage has been super, super useful for us. So I will nab that. Right. Off to Winterhold we go, gang. Let me do a cheeky parkour. Oh, yeah, parkour. Parkour! Parkour! Whoa. 360. Right, let me have a quick... Uh, do I need a drink of ale as well? Just a quick mead. And a little bit of honey. Honey nut treat. There we go. Nice and fed. Hmm. Alright. Let us... Um, so the next quest in the journal is learn the location of the Elder Scroll over in Winterhold, which is so far away it's not even marked on the map. So, um, Bjorlum, I'd like to hire your carriage. Wait, actually, hang on a second. Do you have something else? Do you follow the teaching of the Divines? Oh, okay. Well, there's no point. Um, I'd like to hire the carriage. Can you take me to Winterhold? 50 gold. It's a costly one. It's getting downright hot now. Pff, not anymore, Bjorlum. We're going to the coldest place in, on the planet. Winterhold is so mind-bogglingly cold, I cannot even describe it. It is insane. Smith is going to die. I've only died once, okay? Buy a soul trap spell already. I've got a staff, okay? That's all I need. Yeah, see, they don't even have a stables over here. Like, once you get to Winterhold, there is no way out beyond walking through a bunch of nightmare lands so welcome to home for a little bit they do now have a tavern or well, the frozen half I suppose they always had that tavern didn't they um, I'm just going to make it quick and go straight on over 
I've heard the gourmet is hiding out you somewhere did. in Skyrim. You're oh. The one they call oh, no, not these guys. Um, I don't know what you're talking about. You shall not stand in the way of the oh, no. Let me just quickly walk away. Let me just walk away. No, I'm just going to walk away. Oh, God, he's got... He's a magic user! Run! Be careful, guys. Don't hit the guards. What the hell is that? Critical strike on him. What the hell is this man? What is he even summoning? Why did I hear a... I feel like I heard the uh, the sound of... Oh my god, I accidentally used one of my ethereal potions. Um, let me quickly... There we go, critical strike on him. And I used a poison, so he should be getting low. There we go, another poison, he's dead. Oh my god. There we go, this one should be dead soon. We did it. Oh my goodness. I, it sounded like the ground shakes, and it does that when a dragon arrives, so I'm glad that- DON'T LOOT THEM! You stupid guards! I need to find who sent them. Uh, the orders, absorption, ebony arrows, scroll of destruct construct. That's actually gonna be useful in the dwarven ruins. I'll take the stupid thing. And the spade tail, thank you. Right, good start. Good start. Let's make our way over to the college. Jeez. Um... This way to the college, I think. Right? It's one of these ways. One of these ways is up to the college. The other probably leaves me to a very cold place and I don't want to go. No lollygagging. No lollygagging indeed. No gagging on lollies. Wait, that sounds absolutely... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Take the mask. I don't want to take the mask. We're not doing that quest line. I mean, maybe Welcome we do if I beat the game. Welcome to the I'm College of Winterhold. I'm Faralda, one of the senior wizards. I trust, I trust you your journey to Winterhold was not entirely unpleasant. I mean, I'm here to complain. Blah, 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 blah. If, however, you seek something more, um, I will be happy to assist you. Uh, may I enter the college? But what is it you expect? I seek the knowledge of the El Elder Scroll. It is true, there are some here. But what you seek, it would seem that the college, not just anyone, is a, a small test, if you will. Um... Shit, let me pop on my speech bonus. Mm -hmm. um, I've got a speech bonus, right? Did I get the speech boosting necklace or did I sell that? I think I sold it, didn't I? I sold my speech boost. Yeah, I did. Um, let me pop on the victory reef because that might give me bonuses to sp speech. Have I got like a persuasion? Can I... Uh, let me filter. Is it per... No, it's not. Speech? No. Glib? No. I guess I haven't got a potion that would boost my, my speech, but... The potion of Mark's merchant might just boost that anyway. That's my thinking, because it normally does with this kind of stuff. It's normally all linked. So I'm going to try and hit Frauda with the persuasion attempt. The test, Persuade. You know, Damn it! I don't know anything of the sort. Would you grant entry to the Dragonborn? Yes. So long since we I would be most impressed. There we go. The shout works instead. Splendid. We'll do that. Not your stupid other stuff, it's right? True. And you do have the voice. Would you mind showing me? Yes. Foos. How's that? There you go. How's that? Stories are true. You are Dragonborn. I am Dragonborn. Normally, you'd need to show some I think there is I think you'll be I'll lead you across the bridge. Oh god, Once don't invite me to be a bloody stupid apprentice of your nonsense group. It's the last thing I want to have happen. Alright, round we go. Jeez, look how horribly cold this place is. Just a bunch of frozen boats down there and misery. If you don't know what happened, basically half of this city fell into the sea because some stupid wizards got super stupid with magic is the best way to describe it. And as a result, rightfully, the local inhabitants slightly hate the co- Well, they hate the college. Because they just destroyed the local economy and killed a bunch of people. That's my headcanon, at least. Hello there. Let me give you a bit of advice. What's your advice? A bit of advice is what the- 
That's great advice. Oh, there we go. This opens up. Nice and easy. Right, where am I going to learn about this in the local map? Okay, it's just straight in the center. Let me go talk to the the big big dude in charge. Super Joe Mike says, any chance of a, another Santa Rimworld stream? Maybe. Maybe. Clear the sky, Smith. Oh, does that change the outside weather? I guess, of course, it does. Right, anyway, um, hello. I ain't got time for this. Tell me about the Elder Scroll. Um, oh, Beans, you're not the person to talk to. Into the Arcanum we go. I don't have time for your nonsense, magic boy. Up the stairs we go to the Arcanum. Arcanum, Arcanum. Up we go to the Arcanum. Oh. Right, hello, stranger. Right now in the Arcanium, of which I disrupt my Arcanium. Oh, okay, I'll now, be nice. Do you require assistance? Uh, I'm looking for an Elder what Scroll. What do you plan to do with it? Do you even know what you're asking about? Or are you just someone's errand boy? Um, tell me more about the Elder Scrolls. I knew it. Every an Elder to read an even so. Okay, thanks the for the deep lore. usually take the reader's sight as a price. It would take a month to explain to you. <laughs> the scrolls exist. Sorry. Oh dear. The simplest. It's a reflect. Each. Right, well, come on. Skip through time. the deep law. Ah, you think that it would be kept under the highest security? The greatest thief in. What about? Wait. I'll bring everything we have on them. So don't get your hopes up. It's mostly lies. Okay. Rumor and conjecture. Cool. I will wait. I have a few for you to give me some stuff. What have you got for sale? That's good. Venomous touch. That's useless. That's also useless. Okay, none of these are useful. But thank you, nonetheless, for your useless stuff. All right, right go grab the Elder Scroll Law. Oh, he's going to go grab some fun stuff. Oh, what is that? Seal of Winterhold. Hmm. Fancy. He's going on his little adventure to get some bookies. Let's follow him to get some books. Ah, uh, Spiff, Spiff has got a month. I know, I've literally got a month to beat the game. Well, about 28 days at the moment. Um, we've made good progress this stream, though. We've done a couple of... Well, we did two main quest lines. And now we'll do our third one here, where we have to go to get the Elder Scroll. Oh, hello. What are you? No, oh, you're just normal book. Oh, one of you look to be expensive. Come on, do 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 do. Someone's research notes. Ooh. Map updated. A matter of pride. Locate the ancient warrior's tomb. Shroud half barrow. Oh, the game just crashed. <laughs> oh, come on. That was not the location to bring up your map, Spiff. Don't you know it's illegal to open maps in the library? Sorry, Todd. I was unaware of that important gameplay feature. Super important gameplay feature. Oh dear. Do 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 do. Ah oh, dear dear. Don't worry, these things happen. It's Skyrim. It wouldn't be Skyrim without at least one crash. Book questing. Yes, it's very important. It's very important to do some book questing. But Todd's at it again, goddammit. He says, look, I'm part of the chess club. No no opening maps in the library. That's for chess club time. Someone in chat genuinely asking to let the orc talk. Do you have any idea? Oh, to be fair, he did say don't disrupt his arcanum. He is right. I should have listened. He, he did say don't disrupt it. And this is, this is actual gameplay law where if you disrupt it, game over. <laughs> Oh dear. Brett Grindle says, if you do end up beating Alduin, would you continue this with some of the quests and such? Yes, we will probably do an overtime stream. One overtime stream would be an idea. If we do manage to beat Alduin. Um, I think the way it would work is we'd we'd beat Alduin and then we would um, come in and do a... Uh, oh my god, look at that goblin! Yeah! Wow! Four. 
that's 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 a lot of stuff. Um, right, we'll skip through this again. Now, do you do, 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 do. assistance? And what do you uh, but yeah, do? we would probably do a um. It would be uh, yeah, we'll do a stream of it. I'll bring it. So don't after we well, after Social we finish the videos. With rumor and conjecture. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so after we do the streams, if we beat the game, we'll edit it down into a video, kind of like an edited long form video, probably a couple hours, and then um, uh, then we would have that raid into the live stream, um, which is an overtime basically, probably like the following day or something like that. That sounds fun, doesn't it? The Civ Six ten hour stream. It's a that's a yeah ten hour compilation. Yeah, don't worry, we're not wouldn't go that crazy again. You are new here, are you not? We no, we haven't. Then I am Sav. I am quite. Oh, you're the Archmage. Are we clear? Um, sure. Bye, bye. Now, if you'll excuse me. I just want to speak. I just want to steal stuff again, but I, I know I shouldn't. I just, I can't interact with anything. Todd's gonna punish me. What's this? Aldwin is real. Nonsense. I ain't seen him. I ain't seen proof of that. Where are you at? Oh, you're, you're walking straight back down, of course you are. Wee, down we go. Speaking of hours, what about a 40-hour Skyrim video? Uh, YouTube physically wouldn't let us upload that. That is too long. It is genuinely too there long. There you go. Try not to spill anything on them. Okay, I'll try. Where have you put it? Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. You need a book? You talk to me. Otherwise, you're going to. Did you give it to me? Out of pain. Where's the book? We could learn something. Are you just gonna read it? You wrote it yourself. If you want a book from here, you go through me. Are you gonna give it to me? Or is it? Oh no, it's this here. Ruminations on the Elder Scroll. There we go. Okay, the Transmundane. Sweet. We'll take that. Effects of the Elder Scroll, which I'm pretty sure is just like you lose your vision. <laughs> Sweet. Thank you. The Arcanium is always accepting new volumes. I'll this ruminations yeah. book is incomprehensible. Ah, uh, he's the he's been gone for a long somewhere up. He said he found some. Uh, haven't heard from him since. Oh no. Okay, so I've got to find Septimus Sigmus. God, let me drop down a quick save before I open up my map. Um. He is. Oh my god, he's up there. Jeez, okay, right. We're gonna have to hit the pub and we're gonna have to buy as much hot food as possible. Otherwise, we are going to freeze to death. Jeez. Uh, Stosia Gelu Stefan says, Shall we do another Civ 6 download cycle? Yes, please. If you have YouTube Premium, please download the, um, the, uh, the 10 hour Civ 6 video from yesterday. Please do that as we are testing a watch time exploit that may or may not exist on YouTube. Um, it is very important um, that we test this because it is very crazy if it does work. And there we go. We made it to Winterhold. So we... The problem is I don't have a map. So it's due north, which I think is... So it's vaguely straight that way. Oh my god. Wait, no. So, so we have Winterhold, College of... Yeah, so Winterhold, College of Winterhold, straight up. So it is pretty much that direction somewhere. Oh my god, this is going to be one hell of a trip, guys. You have no... It, it is so risky that we freeze to death at every moment out there. So yeah, I'm going to hit up the pub and I'm going to buy as much warming food as possible. Hopefully they have some. There's the traders, the taverns over here somewhere. Oh, we can download the Civ 6 video. Yeah, if you have YouTube Premium, you can download videos. Um, and I do Winter believe that impressed. there is currently an exploit whereby when you download a video, it fully adds the watch time. Because it classes it as a complete view. As it has no way of tracking it. What did you do? It was a minor Hang on. Let me, let me buy your food. And buy your food. Come on, speed up. This is why people have a problem with your college, Melikar. Come on in. Welcome to Winterhold. What do you food got for sale? For thirsty? Food for the hot rabbit stew. That's the only hot food you've got. Oh, God. This is going to be rough. 
I believe in us, though. I believe in us. We can do this. Until next time. Excuse me. Ranmere beg a drink from you yet? That's gold wasted, friend. Come round we go. Up and over. Yeah, mm hmm What's it? Seeks artifacts. Okay, right, we're not doing that. Next down there, a cellar. Oh dear. Right, off we go. Let's give this a crack, guys. A spiff abandons his side chicks like they belong to the streets. That old what the <laughs> That old mango um is an anagram for mess around and get ousted, rip Janassa and Lydia. Uh, Mango is not an anagram. Oh dear. You're very funny, chat. Um, but yes, uh, we do have to... Look, the members that don't keep up of our, our group do have to be left behind. Because otherwise, like, and by mess up I mean get killed. I can't save people when they're dead. And they, people die. It happens. I can't stop it. Well, I mean, I can do I can do my best to stop it from happening, but it still happens. You are comfortable. Oh, that's nice. That makes one of us. Um, I think there should be a lot of like soul gemable things down here, so I'm going to bind my staff of soul trapping to two, because I know there's a lot of hawkers right along this coastline. These are some boats and everything. And this looks like a bandit hideout, maybe. Or like someone's house. We've got like some ba barricades up. Maybe be careful because this could be a fight. Or maybe this is just like the abandoned docks. Okay, this all looks abandoned. Yeah, this is super abandoned. Yeah, so I guess these are the old... The oldie Winterhold docks. This place used to be the capital of Skyrim, you know. Back before the college blew it up into smithereens. Right, jump on over the ice sheets. Um, by the way, if we fall into the ice, we die uh, near instantly. Um, because the ice is so cold out here. So this is genuinely a jumping puzzle. Whoop. Oh, that was close. Jump, jump, jump. Jump, jump, jump. Ah. <sighs> Acronym, not anagram, damn it. Yes, I know. Don't worry, I worked out what you meant. Um, there's the hawker over there. I think where we're headed is straight that way. So I'll continue my pace in that direction. Good jump. I think if we go left to the hawker island, that should give us a bit of a route around. Um, but have I got a jump here? I've got to go this way. God, this is a risky jump, this one. Can I go this way? No, I think this one's shorter. That was a good jump. That was a good jump. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was a close one. And there we go, we made it. Jump, 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 jump. Oh, sweet. Minimal cold time. If that's what you've got to do. You've got to minimize the cold time. Right, soul trap that beast. There we go. We've got him. He's soul trapped. Now charge it up. Yeet! He did! He does a cute little jump though. Cute little jump. Inigo needs some help. Where's Inigo? Where is he? Where's Inigo? Is he freezing to death maybe? Is he over there? He's over there. He's coming on. He's just a bit slow. Let's harvest some clam. Um, there appears to be a, a tent set up over there. Okay, so I think that's the way we have to go. So I might come up onto this structure and then see if I can drop down the other side. Clear skies, a flame cloak holding a torch. I'll use clear skies, but... Um, there we go, let's clear those skies. Uh, we don't have access to Flame Cloak at all as a spell, so we won't bother with that. Oh, there's a... Is that a Skeever? That looks like a Skeever to me. Well, I mean, we could Soul Trap a Skeever. Oh, hello, you. 
Yeet. <laughs> oh, that was a good shot. MM says companion for dinner. No, no, we should be fine. Inigo should be able to catch up, no problem. He, he's probably just got a little bit cold from the water, but now that we've cleared the skies, he should be uh, warming up in no time. At least that's the hope. Right, what is this? A bunch of skeevers. This is just weird. MM super shattered Breeding $10. Water. Companion for dinner? Compan yummy, yummy companion. Tasty, tasty companion. Wait, was that skeever friendly? Oh, that might have been the friendly skeever. That's the failed skeever experiment. Oops. That one might have been the friendly boy. The pet skeever that you can have. Let me activate the Shrine of Talos. I could be wrong. I might be wrong. No, because the pet skeever's in the Riften, Riften Mines. Yeah, I am wrong. Right, there's another Hawker over there. Actually, if I get my bow out and I target it, I can then use this to go like... Oh. To go like... To go like... Come on, target it properly. Okay, right, look. Aim with bow. Target with staff. Target with staff. How am I not able to target with this? I'm so bad with this. There we go, you've been targeted. Oh wait, no, maybe you have both been targeted. Right, you need to die. Don't dodge, that's rude. Do you have any idea how much I have to spend on these arrows? More than you're worth, I'll have you know. And there we go, one hawker almost dead. There we go, one soul gem. Critical strike on you. And another soul gem from you. There we go, good soul gemming harvesting. Where's Inigo? Inigo, why are you swimming? Get to land, you idiot. Why is that hawker death staring me from afar? That's terrifying. Oh dear. Oh, very strange, Mr. Hawker. Um, where is that experiment? Because that'll actually help mark me. Okay, there we go. There's the site. So it shouldn't be too far away up here. Try and clear the skies a bit. Oh, no, not Present 99 Sorry. super shattered ten dollars and sixty one cents. I'll say this once: make yourself camping supplies so you can have heat, tent, cooking place, and bed, and it is reusable. This mod is hard enough as it is. There's a bear. 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 There's a bear! There's a bear! Okay, this isn't a good place to drop. Goodness, look at that shrine. Um, okay, I think it's probably that island over there is where we need to go, but that's a good new soul gem filled. We've done a great job of filling up soul gems. I will say that. Um, look, present 99, camping supplies, uh, and a tent and a cook place. All really useful, um, and I will probably craft them before we get to Blackreach, I think is my plan. Um, yeah. Oh, there's just a boat floating out there. But yeah, so I think it's that island over there. So can I jump from one of these rocks up onto, um, up onto that bit of land? Well, up onto that next ice sheet. That's my idea All right let me have a chomp of of that warming food because this will keep me warm for a little bit come on, come on, come on, come on. jump 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 climb up there we go okay we can climb up we can climb up whoa look how look how freezing cold we get so quickly jeez this thing is so dangerous All right this way this way chat this is well that's not an ice it's not an ice sheet ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, game. Don't make the ice sheets fake on me. That's the last thing you need to do is fake me out with ice sheets that aren't real. Do you even, can you even see me? Yes, you can. You're not very happy, Mr. Hawker, I'm sorry. Look, Mr. Hawker, I, I need to kill you. Your, your soul gems are too valuable to me. Look at this, we've captured some common soul gems, we've captured some greater soul gems. We're doing great. We're filling up them jemmies. 
Right. This is, I think, a quick swim. Quick, 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 quick. Good job. Freezing cold water. We handled it. No problem. Why did I pick up the hawker tusk? That was meaningless and useless. Gladys and Inigo, you best be catching up, guys. Um, this isn't the island, is it? No. Which island is it? Is it that one there? The weird flat one? It's not that one over there with the tent, is it? Can you become ethereal to swim in the ice water? That's not a bad idea. Part of me thinks it's that island over there, but it shouldn't be because on the map it's it's not that. There's the site. There's the additional island like out there. It's either over there or it's this one here, but this one doesn't look like an island. Oh god, is it the weird iceberg? Let me give the weird iceberg a try. We'll use the become ethereal and see if we can swim it. Have I got any more? Yeah, I've got one more ethereal potion on me. So we've got basically, like, we've got quite a few seconds. Water is freezing cold. Please tell me I can't die here. Come on, fast swim, fast swim. Fast swim. Can I not climb on up? Come on, round, 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 round. Round we go. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. This was a lie. This was a lie. To the right. To the right. It, it is to the right. All right. Make that way. Make it that way. We'll make it this way. We can do it. We can do it. There we go. Out of the water and in. The water is freezing cold. Oh. Draft of shroud. I can't use the potion right now. Shit. We're dead. We're dead. We are so dead. Quick. 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 To the iceberg. To the iceberg. To the iceberg. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Speed. 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 There we go. We use the shout. We use the shout. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, so it's not that iceberg. Okay. Oh, jeez. Let's go around this way. problem is the colder I get the worse my movement speed is as well which makes iceberg hopping even more challenging but yeah I'm gonna presume it's it's vaguely this way casino Lee super shattered $18.25 oh. I often casino wondered how controversial it would be if you revealed you didn't actually like tea this whole time well, I would say it would be quite controversial. It would be like one of the top anime betrayals of all time. However, I can very easily say with a cup of tea. Mm, I love cup of, cups of tea. I really do. They bring me immense joy and happiness. Potion of water walking. <gasps> we do have that, don't we? We do have that weird potion of water walking. I don't even know if it does something, but let's give it a crack. Um... I think that island over there seems potentially good, so we'll give it a try. Potion of water walking. We can run on the seas. Do 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 do. Ain't nobody stopping us. I am super fast and stuff. Ain't nobody gonna stop me now. I'm running on the water. Onto the water. There we go. We did it. Nice. Um, is this the island? No, this doesn't look like the island to me. It's not behind there, is it? It can't be behind there. What if it is behind there? Is it behind this weird big iceberg? Oh my goodness. <sighs> Let me... Let me give it a try. We'll give it a crack. It could be. There's a weird landmass over here. Come on, swift, 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 swift. Got to be really fast. It's freezing cold in here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Up, 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 up. Why aren't they solid? Why aren't they solid? There you go. You're solid. Yeah, this looks like it could be it. Oh, cold. There we go. Good parkouring. Good parkour. 
Uh, whirlwind sprint. Honestly, not a bad idea. Let's do a whirlwind sprint. Come on, come on, come on, come on now. This this needs to be climbable. All right, is this it? This doesn't. This no longer looks like it. Where the hell am I going? Oh my god. Anyone who's done this bit know where he's supposed to go. I've done this bit. I've done this bit a million times, but the issue is in normal Skyrim. Oh wait, hang on a second. Hang on a second. If I press M, it takes me to where I am on the map. I'm up here. I'm here. So it is south and to the left. So it's that way. That is good to know. Right, well, wind spray. Look at that. That's good parkour, isn't it? Let's do a whirlwind sprint here. Oh, healing potion by accident. Come on, let me let me sprint, let me sprint. Come on, let me sprint. Okay, fine, I'll just do a swim. Right, whirlwind sprint. Now, there we go. Jump. I feel like Become Ethereal was way better than this. Ah, Become Ethereal was way better. Um, all right, around we go. So this way and to the left. Let me take a look and press M. It's still putting me in the same spot. Tent Island. It's the Tent Island. Seriously, it was the Tent Island this whole time. I was like, oh, Tent Island would be good fun. That looks like a nice time. So Tent Island is this way. Okay. We're not too far from Tent Island. We can do that. Okay, that whirlwind sprint was useless. Uh, blimey, it's flying says, since there is no uh, IPO, why not a spiff token? Because we, crypto, come on. That's that's reason enough. Cryptocurrency, please. Never again. We've all learned a thing or two. At least I hope we have. Okay, a bunch of ice wolves fighting a hawker. Okay, that did not go far enough. Okay, they they are coming towards me. Oh, he's dead, and the other one's just bolting it. Nice. All right, parkour time. Oh, come on, come on, come on! Up, 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 up. Nice. All right, I think this is the island, right? Oh, 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 hello, 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 hello. No, 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 friend, friend, this is, this is not what we do here, thank you. Oh, jeez. Oh my god, there's a lot of hawkers here as well. Um, right, Tent Island. Tent Island. Let me get some more hawker power. Alright, aim at a hawker. Soul Trap Hawker. Oh, thank you very much. Wow, Mango's brought me a brownie. That's very nice of her. It's just like the last Skyrim stream. Another soul captured. Let's go harvest this other hawker. Sorry, Mr. Hawkers. The entire wildlife population of this ice sheet needs to be murdered so that I can trap their souls to supercharge my ancient space weapons. How could you? Ah, it's look, they're just they're just whales and dolphins. It's not like they're endangered. The chill discovered. Nice. Okay, where is the chill? Way off course. <laughs> oh, thank you very much, though, Mango. Everyone say thank you to Mango. TXR Way, thank you for donating fifty pounds to say hi, Spiff. There is an uh, anniversary edition weapon, the Bow of Shadows. Uh, Soy super get. shattered, sixty dollars oh, and eighty-three cents. Hi, Spiff. There is an A weapon, the Bow of Shadows, you can get if you do quest in the shadows. Ask Stuart in White Run if he has anything else for you. Oh! Bow does more damage than Ebony and gives you 20% faster, faster draw, draw speed, speed and invisibility. invisibility. Wait, it's the assassination quest line. Oh my god, we really should do that. We really, really should do that. Oh my god, if that's the... Yeah, that's the Yarl's assassination quest line. Oh, that's really good. Oh, we should so do that. Yeah, that, that's definitely worth it, in my opinion. Because that questline isn't too difficult to do. Um, Gigaflux says, talk about it, Shivering Isles, am I right? Am I right? Am I right or am I right? It's cold. 
<laughs> Thank you, Gigaflux. That's, that is honestly a super useful donation. Thank you so much. I completely forgot about that quest line and the reward it gave. Nordic Barnacle. Hmm. I'll take you. I'm noticing that our other follower didn't follow us here, and I'm guessing it's because he's one of those followers that won't... Um, because of this mod pack, certain followers won't travel to this, to, like, the super cold environments. Because if they do, they just die. So the game basically counters this by, um... But I need the ethereal shout. Um, the game counters this by basically saying they they don't follow you unless you specifically ask them to. There we go. Fear of shout. Nice. Swimming in the ice sheets. Swimming in the frozen ice sheets. It's super cold. There we go. This is where we are. I should have been like, oh yes, a boat and a tent. How curious. How quaint. It makes perfect sense that he would be out here. But no, I was foolish. It's Septimus Cygnus' outpost. He lives in this cave and he does funny things. Alright, in we go. Alright, down we go. Jeez, his cave's been given. I swear this has been overhauled. Actually, wait, no, 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 this is the same. It's a pretty pimping cave, though. Hello, Septimus Lignus. My goodness, look at those dwarven scarabies. Scrabbies. Hello. Dig. Dig. Excuse me. Dig. Dwemer in the beyond. Oh, Hello, no. Your lost unknown and rise to your... Septimus is but an idiot child compared to the dullest of... When the top level was built, eh? What the heck is no this man? Could be played. Okay, so yeah, this man is insane. How do you know about the Elder Scrolls? Blah, 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 blah. Poor Septimus. So where's the Elder Scrolls? On the cosmological scale. Can you help me get the Elder Scroll? What do you want? Lucky in the depths. Have you heard of Black Reed? Okay, right. Blah, 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 blah. Go to Black Reach. How do I get in? The edge. Okay. Thank you. He knows I get the blank know. lexicon. Okay, fantastic. Thank you, Septimus. Jeez, your place is wild. Ooh, soul gems. Oh, I'd like to take those. But I shouldn't. God, your books are wild as well. Everything about you is crazy. You are you are a crazy man, you know that, Septimus. Okay, I'm warmer. Okay, I should probably stay in here a bit to actually warm up. God, this man literally just sits down here, eats fish, drinks booze. I think he might be insane. Where's it where's even his bed? Where does he sleep? Oh here it is. Here's his bed. Okay, I don't feel too crazy now. Oh my god, he's got an empty wine bottle in his bed. Septimus, have you been drinking in bed? I think Septimus is a little bit doolally, guys. Just a little bit. Alright, now that we've warmed up, uh, let's bugger on out of here. Get back to the land of the living. Okay, let's look at my overworld map. Do 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 do. We are headed to Alftand, which is reached by us wandering down from Winterhold and across. What time is it? 4 a.m. Okay, so it should be warming up as we're going out, which is why I'm okay traveling back out in here. Yeah, I think we do Black Reach and then we try and do the Assassin's Quest. Let's try and make our way back on the ice sheet. Good parkouring, good parkouring. God, yes, look at these Khajiiti moves. Yes! Oh, I was built for speed. Oh, look at that, we got some more Hawkers. Sorry, Mr. Hawker. Yeet. My conjuration skill increases whenever I do this. And I'm afraid you must die. Oh my goodness. Uh, let me, seeing as I have so many soul gems, I might as well charge up my bow. Common soul gem, there we go. Right, charge up on you. Hit you with my bow. There we go, that lowers your armor, so it should literally just be two hits to kill. Okay, no, it still takes three hits. Okay, well, 
Still some effect. No soul gem large enough. Oh, I guess these guys are just petty soul gems, right? Oh dear. Ah, there we go. Become ethereal. Yeah, fine. We've filled up all of our common soul gems, I guess. Uh, well, not common. Petty. How many do we have? Eight. Eight petty soul gems filled up. Inigo, why are you running around like a lunatic? Actually, wait. I, I pull out my bow. Oh, no. Don't wait. Don't wait. Don't wait. I meant charge. Charge. Ah. Right. Inigo, uh, let me soul trap it. And then I will charge this with a petty. There we go. Much better. Right. Now we can kill it, Inigo. And it will charge the, the bow that we're using to defeat it. Splendid. No soul gem large enough. Wait, are you are you higher than Petty? Are you a great soul gem? Hawkers are great soul gems? You can't undercharge gems? Jeez. Okay. Funky. I was reading that completely wrong like a melon. But oh well. Get camping gear first. Don't worry, I will I will remember. The I mean most of the camping gear we can craft. Uh, but yeah, I think we'll need a at least a bedroll. The general goods store in Winterhold, I think, should... Oh, hello. Should keep us uh, sorted. Let me uh, clear skies. There you go. Nice and summery weather. Sky Temple Ruins. Am I getting shot at? Oh, yes, I am. Hello. You're dead. Why are you shooting at me? Ancient Nord arrows? Whoa, hello! No, you can put that glowy war axe of yours away. Ancient Nord Warhammer of Frost. No, thank you. Skyhaven Temple. Nice. Careful. I'll be careful. They're just level one skeletons. I like. There's careful. And then there's level one skellies. Like, this is fine. This is completely fine. This is just a dead skeleton right here. Potent aversion to poison. That's a nice find. Yeah, sweet. We're not going into the temple, though. Don't worry, I'm not that crazy. We could go grab that word wall up there, but also, likewise, I'm not crazy. Oh, jeez. Right, let's do the... Oh, no, no, that's the wrong shout. I thought I had the ethereal shout selected. Doesn't seem to matter, though, as I appear to be able to parkour. Right, we've done a good trip, if I'm being honest. I'm pleasantly surprised by the lack of death we ran into. Right, so up we go. Jump on over, jump on over, jump on over, jump on over. We'll make our way back up to Winterhold. Visit and nip into the local trader, and we should be on a pleasant way. Hmm. Nice, lovely cup of tea. Right. Up we go. And I think this is the pathway. It's either this one or the one next. No, this is the pathway. Hello there, little fox. But yeah, honestly, things are going really quite well this stream. I've been pleasantly chuffed by by how successful this has been. The air is treacherously cold. There we go. Give it a nice clear sky. Warm it up. We might be in uh, in Winterhold, but that doesn't mean we need to freeze to death. I've been oh, for Jesus Christ! That was a jump scare. What? What was that? <laughs> what the? What are there ghosts? Chat, I have just experienced a um, um, an aberration. What the hell was? I'm gonna have to have a break to eat my my, my brownie. What was that? What are? The, I, I'm scared. I am genuinely scared. <laughs> Is this why the guards say must have been the wind? Alright, you think you're fine? And then just a man appears? Oh my goodness. 
That was actually crazy. That was very entertaining indeed. Right, is the, uh, yeah, this is locked until the morning, right? I'll wait until the morning, like 10 a.m. it should be open, right? 8 a.m. Oh, it's cold. It's cold. Let's quickly eat some food. Mammoth stew, mammoth stew. There we go, hot mammoth stew. Was that, did that work? Hot rabbit stew? That's better. And Brina's Ottomans is open. There we go. Okay, we have to use some hot food, but that's fine. Oh, ghost or premonition? I'd like, my goodness. That was incredible. Hello, Brina. Maybe I'm the dragonborn, and I just don't know it yet. Maybe you're the dragonborn. You could be. Um, what do you got for sale? Have you got a large fur tent and bedroll? Yes, you do. I'll be taking that. Have you got a cooking pot? Yes, you do. I'll be taking that. Ebony ingot. Jeez, where the hell you get that? Bloody heck. Um, gold garnet ring. Don't need that. Uh, iron sword. Lesser soul gem. I'll take that. Why not? Um, ring of major recovery and stamina. You've got surprisingly good loot on you. Uh, but yeah, I'll take all of that nonsense. Thank you. Thank you very much. Right, so now that we... Oh, actually, can I exchange some coins? Oh, no, I don't have any. Uh, there we go. Hi. Right, um, Gladys? I've, actually, no, your inventory is kind of full, isn't it? Oh, no, it shouldn't be anymore. I need to carry something, Gladys. Um, please, can you carry the tent as well as the cooking pot? Thank you very much. There we go. Good job, Gladys. You're doing great. Do fire salts make hot food? Uh, yes, they do. Uh, but only if you know the recipes, and I don't. I don't know the recipes. But yeah, now that it's daytime, um, the weather should be a bit better. Especially if I do that and clear up the skies a bit. All right, let's make our way over to uh, Blackreach, right? That's where we go. I'm very cold. I'm very cold. It's just a chilly day. What more can I do? I can I can clear the skies every now and again, but um, the main quest genuinely can't wait. I can't wait for the weather to improve. I can't really... I don't have the time to run to Winterhold and grab more hot food supplies. And it should be hot down in, down in the caves. That's my thinking. There's fires down there. Yes, Biff killed Lydia. I didn't kill Lydia. Lydia was... Oh, wait, no, she was frozen in ice. She was frozen. Was that one of my ice arrows? Oh, no. Did I actually kill Lydia? Am I the reason Lydia died? Am I the baddie? Light armor increased. Oh, it's because of that thing. No. Go away. Go away. I don't have time for your nonsense today. This is a no-nonsense day. Oh dear, I accidentally went the wrong way. Come on, where's the trolley? There we go, he's dead now. We got a nice hit there. Go on, Gladys, you got it. Okay, I'll finish it off. Good job, Gladys. Right, now, if I remember correctly, it's not this first one we want to go. We want to kind of get over to... Uh, Closer to Winterhold, so we'll do that. We'll go around. There's the mine over here as well, if I remember correctly. Soul trap. No soul trapping. Um, I didn't have... I don't think I can use the staff on horseback. That. Where did that arrow go? Where is that arrow going? Where do you think that arrow is going to go? Oh my goodness, hello. Oh, it's the career. I've been looking for you. Hello. That's... Please tell me. Oh, folk firebeard. Folk firebeard. Okay. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Letter from Folk Firebeard of the Blue Palace. That's strange. I mean, we did we did do his quest, didn't we? Over the last few days, we've had some disturbing information to the light regarding the events of Wolf Skull Cave and the summoning and the binding ritual. Oh no, you're asking me to return to Solitude to help again. Um, look, we'll deal with the Wolf Queen after we've. Um, we've dealt with that. What's in your horse's inventory? Um, horse's inventory is pickaxe, a bunch of potions, an axe, 
uh, Draft of the Defender, for a saddle, uh, Amulet of Talos, and a little camp. But not a big one, just a little one. Just a little camp. Okay, here's the mining cave. We'll run past this. But I, I do want to walk past it closely because it gets marked on our map and that helps with navigation. So we go drop down a little quick save. Where is that in terms of navigation? Okay, straight parallel. So we want to kind of go right as soon as we can. And I think that leads us this way. That is a saber cat. Horsey, I think this might be where our journey together ends. There we go. That's a soul trap connection. That is a saber cat. Whoa. No, that just missed. Why did we have an animation for that? Why did we have an animation for what was clearly a miss? There we go. That one was a hit. Oh, dear. Snowy Saber Cat. It's the eye of the Saber Cat. Where's my horse? Horsey. Coming over, horsey. Come on, we're going up this hill. Who the heck is this? Why are you walking around over here? Oh, it's... Well met. Well Hello, Cat Dojo. Oh, you're on a pilgrimage. Good for you. Making the ah, you return. I'll leave you be. Do, 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 do. Because it was a close miss. Well, if it was a close miss, show me it's a close miss and not just a whiffed shot. But thank you, Robert Davies, for the uh, reminder of my horse inventory, by the way. That was... There's another troll up there. Oh, you're getting better at riding. I can get a new perk. Sweet. Um, right. Let me just get my bow out. Okay, he has seen me straight away. Why is he running at me? Oh no, that counts as a sneak attack for 5.8 times damage. We just two hit a troll. Good job. Soul trap. Soul captured. Mind you don't fall off that thing. Alright, now I think it should be up to the right, because it was slightly parallel with the mines. Oh look, there's the shrine. Look at that. Funky little shrine. If we can mark that on our map, that'll help with navigation as well. But I don't really need to go up and say hello. There's probably bandits up there knowing this game. It's always bandits. Uh, like, why would you be a bandit and position yourself up here on the Shrine of Azura? It's just freezing cold. I go Shrine of Azura, yeah, literally just parallel. So let's go along the road. And there it is. We can see it. That's where we need to go. Deep into the mines with the ice wraiths. Bloody hate ice wraiths. I don't even know where these shots are going. Where's the shots going? Okay, the shots are going somewhere. That was actually a hit. How was that a hit? I'm not going to be able to hit any of this. Yeah, look at them. They just move around like absolute lunatics. I'm just going to go past these ice wraiths. Gladys, you're doing a great job of distracting them. Keep it up. But ice raping, aim for me. But yeah, if you if you're just joined and you need an explanation, hop into the description and it should explain quite a lot about what we're doing. Was that a forsworn little? Oh, sorry, horsey. Is this forsworn? Oh no, Falmer. Yeah, it's a Falmer pit. Oh my god, I need to tell you something about this. Um, so Mango was actually playing around this area and I got her to fall into the pit, and she was severely under leveled for the entire process. There's a frost troll coming at me. Okay, we got a hit. Uh, corrosion poison? No, I think just regular poison, right? Yep, yeah, regular poison. Because we need to do something to basically outstrip the troll's natural healing powers. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Critical strike, that's what we want to see. And he's dead. And we get a soul. Thank you, frost troll. Good job, Gladys. Thanks for being a distraction. Oh, dear. 
But yeah, uh, when, when Manga was first playing Skyrim, I got her to go into the pit and she wasn't leveled. And uh, her last save was ages ago. She was not happy. Not happy at all. Uh, she did eventually beat the pit down there. But she had to fight a lot of Falmer. Like, it's a ridiculous amount of Falmer down there. Let me try and kill that bear. So I mean Snowcat. Critical strike? That wasn't even a stealth. No, 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 thank you, Skyrim Terrain, for the save. And it's dead. Two crits in a row, not bad. Right, is it up or down? I can never remember. I think it's up to get in. Oh, there we go. Go, Mango. I mean, yeah, Mango is, like, Mango plays Dark Souls quite regularly, so... She, uh, she did, she, she grinds. Like, if she faces an impossible opponent, unlike me who will go back and find a way to cheese it, she will persevere at an incredible rate. Where's Nigo gone? Guess he's got to catch up. Oh, there he is. I think I see him running in the distance. Right. Can you rename the horse to Frey Bentos? No, you can't. Unfortunately, you can't rename the horses and set their name. Um, I wonder if the exploit works to... Oh my god, is that... Who the heck is this? Is this our... Oh. I was like, oh look, a friend. No, it's a Vigilant of Stendor. Why are the Vigilant of Stendor trying to immediately murder me? I don't know. What have we got... It? What have we done against them? I mean, I know we attacked one of their people not too long ago, but... Surely they can forgive that. Uh, Potion of Healing, they're nice. Vigilance Decree. Let's read that, because that might actually explain it. Uh, I've learned the identity of a Daedra worshipper walking among us. His name is Chairman Meow. I'm not a Daedra, Daedra worshipper. What the hell? What the hell, Mr. Stendar? Okay, I'm going to see if uh, one of the exploits work. Because this is Aftland. Um, but I think there is... There used to be an exploit to glitch into the uh, the wall here to pull a lever, but I don't think that's that's the case anymore. No. Annoying. Oh, am I able to do... There's no way this is the case. It's very unlikely. Um, do, do, do. Where is it? Interact from afar. No, I can only interact with Gladys or Inigo. Okay, that's fine. We'll ignore that. So... We found Aftland. We must now go and recover the Elder Scroll. Am I invisible? Yes, you are. Oh. What is this? Activate control port. Funky. All right, there is. Uh, is that the entrance over there? That might be the entrance. It's a door. We got the tents of the people who were here for a little expedition, if I remember correctly. There we go, yeah, expedition manifest. Poor fools, thought they'd go down here. Uh, it is actually well worth reading those uh, logs. It's some really, really good writing uh, from the actual game designers, in my opinion. Some of their best in the game, following this little doomed expedition. Poor chilly boy. Oh, look, the scroll is literally just down there somewhere. Oh yeah, we go down these steps, I think. It should take us to it. Here we go. Yep, there we go. There's the entrance. Not that doorway. Do 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 God, it's a weird funky place, isn't it? Oh. You think the classic tr bucket trick works if you recall correctly? Yeah, it can do. There are two entrance. Well, we're doing the first one. Let's begin. We've got the biggest, probably the biggest single quest line of the game ahead of us. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. The brownie I consume refuels me. It improves me, it emboldens me. Let us just sneak our way through. Dwarf and metal ingot, nice. Just a bit of sneaking. We don't need to do anything too crazy. 
As you can see, some people were here and have since been murdered. Ooh, loot. Oh, loot. Oh, very nice. Thank you. Thank you, expedition people. It's never nice when there's a blood splatter and then just a giant pile of bodies. Well, bones. Not even yeah, not even body parts. Just just the bones. Never a good sign when it's just the bones, and the blood continues. Oh dear. Where's well, a potion there? Where is it? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself, Jesus. Oh. You always try to keep. I can it hear yourself. people. No, there's got to be more school. Oh no, they want they want the skooma. I mean I've got some skooma on me, I could give them some skoomy. In we go. Down we go. God, it's so spooky. It's pretty spooky. You can get a woodcutter's axe here. We have got a woodcutter's axe. It's in my horse inventory. Is there a dead Dwarven spider? I think that is a dead dwarven spider. Which is the game's way of saying, hey, this is what you're about to fight for the next millennia. Get used to it, chump. Right. Do 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 do. Very spoopy. Very, very spoopy chat. Right, which way do I have to go? I'm pretty sure it's just straight on. I'm not going to trust going left and finding Mr. Skooma Man. Is this a quill? Research notes. Bunch of research notes. Search the Dwarven Spider. Common Soul Gem is very good. Lots of Soul Gem fragments as well. And a Petty Soul Gem. Book on Dwarves. Can I get through this door? No. There's the Dwemer Inquiries Volume 1. Right, let me try and make my way up here. Fuck, there's our first one. Okay, 125 health. They've got two shots. Two shots. Not bad. God, they've got some good loot on them, these little spideys. Oh. YouTube premium reminder? Um, actually, uh, I'll give it a check, because I might be able to see from the um, stats already if there's been an impact on the average percentage viewed. Let me take a look at the stats. Because that's basically what we're taking a look at, is the audience gauged first 24 hours what time is it now 5 p.m. no I was streaming after that I guess I probably won't be able to tell until tomorrow yeah I won't be able to gauge it until tomorrow that's fine we we'll, should be able to get a good gauge on it tomorrow and know if it's had a discernible impact oh hello no, 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 sir, 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 sir. There is no need for you to be a f angry friend. There you go, you're dead. Whew. Take my ebony arrow back. Oh, this is where we heard the uh, disagreement earlier. My god, ebony and gold earrings. Not bad loot. Where would I be hiding? Probably somewhere warmer. Back up, Gladys. Thank you. Oh my goodness, Skyrim never gets old. It really doesn't. It like genuinely, in my opinion, phenomenal game. It's dead. That was a sneak attack somehow. I guess I I'm, I'm wearing like really 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 good boots that numb my detection stats into the abyss, which makes me hard to spot. 
Something other than my name donates two dollars. Say I'm calling the uh, Skekarim Dragonborn die a lot. No, we're not gonna die a lot. We've only died. Okay, I get the feeling this man's gonna be crazy. Who is this brother? Another of the smooth skins looking for food? This one was in touch with us. Hello, are you friendly or hostile? No. You must be the one who okay, he's very clearly hostile. Jeez, he's got 489 health. Hopefully, he was evil. God, he's got some nice loot on him. Uh, he's There's the woodcutter's axe. He's the person who, okay, went a little bit crazy and appears to have murdered. Oh, his friend was stealing the skooma. But it's empty. Never steal the skoomas. It's important. Alright, drop down another save. This is where we have to fight a centurion, isn't it? I'm calling it now. First centurion fight. There's oil on the ground and everything. This is giving centurion fight vibes. Oh, no. yeah, oh, it's the spheres. There we go. Critical strike. Fuck it out. I think that was, yeah, I accidentally critted an ego there. Come on, let's kill this one. We go one dead. Second one. Jeez, we don't we we don't do too much damage. Around about like twenty a shot. Four. But there we go. Good job. We killed him. These spheres. God, they've got soul gems on them like nobody's business. Greater soul gems, and they're filled. Gosh, this definitely does make adventuring through here a little bit easier. These can pop some more boys as well, aren't they? Are you gonna pop? Nope. Okay, no popping. Nice. Free soul gem. Oh. Right, straight on we go. Chat, you asking if I'm winning, son? I'm winning, I would say. I've got... What? When did I last save? When did I last save? When did I last save? Don't die, my friend. No! Why, why would you say are you winning, son? Why would you say that? Okay, it's, it's from literally just around the corner. Why would you say are you winning, son? You cursed me. You cursed me. We lose a day. Day 57. That's the second death of the stream. Right, what killed me here? And let me switch my shout to um, become ethereal. Let me just become ethereal. There we go. That worked. Becoming ethereal. Solved it. This is going to definitely produce an enemy. But the enemy appears to be behind us. Oh, no, Inigo's dealing with it. Inigo, you best not be fighting. No, you're not fighting Gladys. You're just fighting something else. Oh, definitely going to the supercut. Yeah, the, chat, that's going to the supercut. Clip it. Press the clip button because then it's definitely going to the supercut. And you go, you really best not be fighting Gladys. Okay. I I don't think they are. It'd be madness if they were. This seems like there's definitely yeah, there we go, there's a spider. Dead. Another spider. Dead. Oh, Stealthin is good. Stealthin makes me feel good. That was gold. That was not gold. That was sadness for me. Let's pick this dwarf lock. What do we got in here? Oh, another chest. 
Hmm. Not there. What about there? A little bit more. There we go. Dwarven coin, a diamond ring, and some Dwemer gauntlets that we won't use. Or oh, chest. Another chest. Oh, oh. We've got Dwarven short sword and an emerald. Very nice. All in all, good loot. Some gems are good. Annoyingly, chat, I'm actually feeling incredibly... I'm feeling really quite run down. Um, I thought I'd be able to stream for a full six hours, but I'm actually really struggling. Not um, not anyone's fault or anything. I just, I know I just don't feel too well at the moment. So I think, quite annoyingly, I might have to end the stream early. Ah... <sighs> Let me let me take off my jumper and then I'll see how I feel. I'll be one moment. We. You clipped it when you put the link. Uh, you can pop it on. Oh, you can pop it on the Discord. Shoot it to me on the Discord. Oh. Oh dear. Yeah, sorry. It's because I guess I've had quite a busy weekend with family and whatnot. So it does kind of come catching up to you after a bit. And you go, what the hell are you fighting? You are fighting Gladys! Stop it, you idiots. Alright, let me shoot an ego. God. Well, I mean, I can shoot Gladys and that might stop it. Because Gladys can't die. There we go, Gladys needs some help. Can you guys sort it out? Oh, I suppose they should sort it out, actually, if I do a quick save and a quick load. Uh, that should reset their hostile nature. Oh. Ending early means this won't be the last stream. That's true. I'll have to do some more. Oh, dear. Which isn't a problem. I do like doing more. Let's see if I can do a bit more. There's a spider. Dead. Dead. Oh dear. Do 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 do. Yeah. I just, uh, I think I am, unfortunately, not very well. I need to go have a lie down. I did have quite a long day yesterday, and I didn't get a good amount of sleep, so I think I'm going to have to drop down a save, and we'll have to call this stream here at only 4 hours and 20 minutes long. I know. I know. How terrible of me. Oh, dear. I will grab um, these whilst I'm here. And there's a bed, actually. This is a good spot to end, because I can use this bed to have a sleep. Yeah, this is a good spot. We'll do this. Was it the brownie? Is Mango avenging Lydia? No, I've had those brownies before. It wasn't the brownie. I was feeling a little bit off before the brownie. But I thought I could persevere myself. I was unfortunately unable to. Donk Meme donated $10. Say, I love Inigo. Please support his modder if you can. The modder's name is Smart Blue Cat. You know what? I'll give that a search up afterwards, after the stream. And I'll see if I can um, check a donation his way. Because he was very good. It's a very, very fun little follower to have. But yeah, thank you also, Clockwork Orbris. But yes, I will, um... Donk Meme Super Shattered $10. Oh, I love Vinigo. Please support his modder if you can. The modder name is Smart Blue Cat. Oh. oh my goodness. Yeah, sorry, chat. I didn't expect to be, um... I expected I'd be able to do another 5-6 streams, no problem today. But unfortunately, not the case. Not the case. I'll go over lie down. I'll rest up. Um, a Smith is sick at 4.20. I knew it. I know. What a terrible timing on the stream. But thank you very much for watching today, everyone. Thank you, seriously, for everyone who donated. You were far too generous. You didn't need to be. Like, um, it, it's 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 crazy that, you know, present 99, you are an absolute lunatic. And when you combine forces with the Green Joker, it was, it was terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. But thank you very much, the two of you, for your continued support. And uh, Scott Wiggum as well, one cooler guy, you absolute legends, and everyone else who donated and even just liked the stream. That's very kind of you. I'll go over lie down, um, and hopefully we'll be back next weekend for some more Skyrim. In fact, it should literally be next Sunday, and that might even be the final stream. That might be the final stream. Maybe. Maybe we make it a special one. Maybe we uh, we make it an extra long stream 
whereby we don't finish until we beat Skyrim. That could be good fun. All in one sitting. God, that would be crazy. Anyway, lots of love, everyone. I'll see each and every one of you in the next one. Have a lovely day. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.